Go! 
Now this... Alright. This is what I came to hog for. Come on. Come on. Let me tell you. The air feels a little different here. On this night. On this September 26th. Thursday night. Because we got... We got a lot of people. We got a lot of new people. We got a lot of old people. Mike is a thousand decibels. Yo, my bad, brother. I'll try and move it away a little bit. Hopefully that's better. But yeah, a lot of people came out. Close to 30. I mean, 28, I think. Exactly. Yeah, my bad. But yeah. Air. Do you remember the 26th night of Hogtamber? That's what I'm saying. So yeah, a lot of people came out. New kid on the block. Tommy. I think came from New York. Young Gun. He just beat my ass. He's pretty good. Puff Fox Dual Mate. He says Puff is his uh, better of the two. So he's been all the talk of the town, talk of the chat. Uh, we, someone said Weewaw was entering. I don't see Weewaw anywhere. Trail was maybe going to enter, but not really. He was in a conference. Beckvin's out here. We got the usual host of characters. <laughs> I'd kick him. <laughs> You'd kick him. Yeah, I don't know. He seemed good. I mean, yeah, he 3 0 me, but. I don't know. It's always interesting. Always good to see new blood out here. Ooh. <laughs> I almost came. Oh, I gotta play. I'll be back.
What is up, gamers? You should be able to hear me. Um, we got Buns in Conflict. Uh, Buns was really excited to be able to play Conflict today. He's like, it's about time we had a chance. Hi. What's up, uh, Spades? Espades? Um, he was like, it's about time we had a set. Oh, no! Oh, he had to tech it. What the? What the hell? These guys are just doing whatever. Oh! That's rough. You're dead. Oh, no. I don't think Kelly knows that I'm not there. Kelly did not know that I wasn't there and she just thought I was th sitting there. Um, Alright, we got Brub and Tommy up next. One of the potentially crazy sets today, right? Potentially crazy. Now let me, let me lay down the story for people who aren't aware. Tommy catches a post by Kuro on Reddit of all places or on Facebook or somewhere. I don't know what he did. But in the Yukon saying, yo, challenge me, I'm going to be, I can beat anyone, blah, blah, blah. Because uh, Kuro, someone who's going to tournaments, someone with some wins under his belt, doesn't have anyone at Yukon to threaten him like that. Uh, and Tommy finds the post, they play a best of five, and Kuro barely wins. Tommy says, yo, I'm really rusty, I haven't been playing. You know. That was awesome. Uh, and then, barely loses, and then, I guess he practices up, and he plays at the next Yukon Weekly and wins by a lot. And then, the next Yukon Weekly, Brub, Beckvin, Roby all show up. Kuro's there. And then Beckvin uh, loses to Tommy. This random guy, yo, Alex Firewind, this random guy hasn't been to like it much. Has only been to a few tournaments, but I guess he's from New York City. He's going to Yukon. He's a freshman now. So, the storylines are here. Because he was talking a big game. What's up? A big game. Big game. He was talking a huge game. Um, after winning a couple of UConn tournaments uh, with people like Beckvin, Brub, Roby, Kuro in attendance, right? Um, so he, he didn't have to beat nobody. Like, he, it's not like he had to beat nobody to win. You know, it's he's not like he's beating Brub right now. The dream bracket. Yeah, he's beating Brub. Uh, wow. Yeah, you got to DI that away. <laughs> uh,. See, so DI buff down throw away, and then she can't, like, rest you. <laughs> yeah, I'm surprised, honestly, that Brub got hit by a rest there. Yeah, I mean, I'm not sure how many puffs he's played, and usually when Puff gets grabs on the spaces, they, they like going for up throw. Yeah, but I think um, they were under a platform, right? So might have been just trying to go for... Yeah, but even like, it's, it's the a platform hard... is still great. Like, uh, it, it, they forced... Well, that's chase. what I'm saying. Like, that's why he probably went for down throw. Oh. Well, I'm saying the Puff is puff still... Got a good up throw under the platform. Yeah. Because yeah. it, it'll be forced to tech. Okay, taking the quick one pretty quick. Pretty comfortable. Setting the tone for the set. Brub, maybe you haven't had to get comfortable playing against Tommy with a playstyle as his own, you know? Look, Tommy's Brub's playstyle. favorite stage now. So oh, yeah? <laughs> loves Pokemon Stadium. Nice. Yeah, it's a good one for Fox. Low ceiling, lots of space to like jump around and laser. The platforms are a good height to be able to, to jump in up air um, or back air. Oof, that was Ooh. nice. Yeah, that's that'll catch you a couple times. That's what you gotta but do. As soon as Tommy starts scoping that out, it might get dangerous. But if as soon Ooh. as he starts scoping it out, Brub gets an easy jump to ledge, right? 
if you, you have to give Fox space to be able to avoid getting hit by that, so it kind of like helps him recover in the future. If he like kind of shows that he's he's uh, potentially interested in uh, doing the upper from off stage. Tommy so, just miss that edge guard there. That's rough. Yeah, I mean, you know, you can't always edge guard Fox. If you can kill no, Fox can. thirty percent of the time, that's hype. Fox. If you're Jigglypuff, you should always be edge guarding Fox. Yeah, every they time. They should never come back to stage. Okay. Well, Alex Fire win the one hundred and one, guys. Ooh, big damage. I'm just saying what's um, up. Yeah. So, think about this. Is on this stage, you get puffed till I think like 67 or 8, I forget what percent it is, and then up throw up air kills. Yeah. So grab kills and then up smash also kills now especially. The nasty know, thing is like up tilt starts killing too on this stage. Yeah, at, at a lower percent. Well now you're, you trade stocks, that's honestly kind of fine. Ooh. Yeah. See, I he, he went for like a, a dash JC up smash. I think what I would do if I was in a position, just hold right until I was at puff <laughs> and then just like press up on the C stick. Don't mess it up. Don't give yourself the opportunity to mess up tech skill because yeah. you have plenty of time and you, there's no need to charge. He was at 100. Like, yeah. That's going to kill for sure. So, I mean, he went for the technical thing. Maybe he was confident in the tech. Uh, it kills at like 50, upper upper. Yeah, it kills yeah, really early on stage. Maybe, maybe I'm thinking of a different stage. Uh, I think 57 is another. I don't that know, right but Tommy just on, got the kill on, on the edge on guard, as he should. Yeah. <laughs> well, this is still close. All right, Tommy, looking to get his rematch with Beckfin. Say, hey. Oh, also, when when Beckton lost on monitor or at a Yukon, Beckton was like, "Yeah, the kid's good, uh, but also monitors." So, because <laughs> uh, Yukon uses monitors, they're local. I don't so think it we'll really does we'll anything. We'll see. I mean, some That's people are really opinion. comfortable. I mean, especially older uh, people who have been playing a lot more. Like, you know, it it affects things. Uh, if like the the relative amount of time spent playing on monitors is a lot higher for newer players because of Slippy and stuff. Yeah. Um, I mean, I also used to play on those monitors all the time, so I guess I was used to them. Yeah. Ooh, that was clean. Ooh. I don't know if the F-Smash is on purpose there or not. Ooh. Some tech skill flub. Giving uh, Tommy a good one. Ooh, clean. Wave land in up tilt. Ooh, so who does the out. who does the winner of this play? Do you know? Uh, winner of this play is the winner of Bingy Beckman. Okay, gotcha. Ooh, that was a really clean grab, by the way. Ooh, went for some courageous stuff there. Brub not not intimidated by the stock lead and the two game lead. Saying, hey, I'm going to show you what I've got. You know what I'm saying? Great DI on the up throw. Not enough space for Puff to really get a good follow-up. That's rough. At least he stock trade. It's hard. Uh, so against Puff, I mean, like, it's it's really hard not to at, at sometimes, like, not DI the up throw. Uh, but I think it just needs to be, like, an ingrained thing in your mind. Oh, man, this is going to be hard. I feel like Brub is just being too aggressive like hey, I really I, mean, I, I feel like Tommy's just waiting to get the reversals he's just waiting to get the rest setups and kills and I feel like Brub's just giving it to him too easily like he can slow it down a little bit because it's not working Ooh. just running in yeah you could think he missed the dash on the jump so he didn't have enough horizontal momentum to hit the DI away Ooh, missing the punish there. This is gonna be hard. Yeah. Yeah. Rough 3-0. Hey, Tommy getting another shot at Beckfin. Shot at, at Beckfin. Did he beat Beckfin? No. Yeah. I'm. I'm saying like, getting a chance to show to to show that to it prove, wasn't a fluke. To prove you know, it's not a fluke. Okay. To prove it, or at least trying to. You know. I don't know if she called me. She might have called me. Did she say already, Roby? I don't know. I wasn't. Who listening. knows? I don't know. I'm trying to wait for her to say, or look at me. <laughs> well, I'm sure that if it is a set that you're supposed to be going to, you'll get more than that notification. I think Roby is walking over. It looks like he is. 
You could just ask Roby. <laughs> Alright, I'll, I'll go see. I'll go see. Hayden, where are you at? Why are you not here? In the library? What are you studying? What do you get, midterms? Come on. Midterms can wait. This is the hog of the century right now. Yeah, burnout's rough. So we got Artie, Roby, Artie, very dominant in the one-to-one -one here. But Roby's the rock today. So who knows what Roby's cooking, am I right? Can you smell it? Can you smell what the rock is cooking? I do. It's a victory. We're getting Jay Killer on the mic, pulling the hair back, just like the ladies do. It's a side with the circle. All right, can you hear me? Yes, we can hear you. So Jay Killer, we got Roby, we got Artie. I played Roby. Um, he kinda, I played Artie. Roby kind of beat me up. Not gonna lie, <laughs> it wasn't very um, good. Like in the match or? Yeah, yeah. Wow. Um, are you I did okay? remember I should be resting him. Yes, that, so, is, uh, that is helpful in the matchup. That definitely made the last game a lot better, but first two games I was not resting and it was bad. Um, but Artie doesn't need to rest. Artie just has to oh. smack. Hello, Hayden. Um, yeah, Artie, Artie doesn't need to worry about this matchup. <laughs> well, unless it's against Chudad. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, that no. guy, that guy, take him out. Artie doesn't want us to talk about this anymore. Okay. He's fine. having PTSD. Is he really? Yeah, he told me. He I don't said, know if I believe what you're saying. He said you, you make up stuff all the time. Don't talk about Chudat on stream ever again. Hell's yeah. Hell's yeah. <laughs> 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 uh, so you played you played Roby, and he beat yeah. you up. Oh yeah. Did you play Artie? No. No. Because I played Roby and lost, so I didn't really have the opportunity to play Artie. Who else did you play today? Um, I don't know. I <laughs> I blocked it out. <laughs> I don't remember. I don't remember what happened. So, hey, Jay Killer, how's your tournament going? Are you oh, still in? What no, happened? I, um, so I, I played against uh, this player, Kuro, and he was yeah. playing pretty well. Yeah. I was playing kind of mid, if I'm being honest. <laughs> okay. And then I played against this, like, Puff player. Uh-huh. And we were both playing bad. Oh, both of you. Oh, <laughs> yeah, wow. we were both playing So the bad. other puff must be very embarrassed. Then. Um, no, I feel, oh, okay. I, I think that they should feel embarrassed, but. Oh, okay. But I don't think it, I don't think it was that bad. I'm more embarrassed because of how badly I played. Yeah, how about the set after that? Um, and then I, I lost to Lottie, but it was super close. I was ahead all three games and then I SD'd. Wow. So you're saying it was a close 3-0? It was not. I oh. I should have won, but I didn't. All right, we're going to stadium here. Oh wow! Rock oh, is immediately no. getting 39% on him, just like Survivor. Um. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like we've commentated this match, this exact set before, where it was Artie versus Roby. Well, last week, me and Eddie Connecticut literally commentated the same set twice in a row. <laughs> Because it was like everything happened the same way between the two sets of grand finals. Oh, you mean Egg versus Artie? Arn. Oh, that was la I keep thinking that Egg came here like two weeks ago. I mean, one week ago. But I guess it was two weeks ago. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know what to tell you. I don't know. So, what do you think? Uh, what do you think Roby should do um, as the Sheik player since you also play this uh, Sheik? 
Um, well, I tried to play Sheik against Artie, and I... How'd that go? Not well, so I don't ever play <laughs> Sheik against Artie. Um, oh, no. Because at least, like, I, the match I've taken... I've taken games in friendlies with Puff. I will never. Oh, I have, wow. I've never done it with. I've never done it with Sheik. That's crazy. I don't even think that the best Puff player in Connecticut has done that. Well, in friendlies. Yeah. Artie's a beast. I've never taken a game off of him in bracket. Yeah. Well, Artie in friendlies is, is a different. It's a different kind Look, of beast. Peak Alex Firewind can be any player. Whoa. A skilled Alex Firewind Fire <laughs> could be any ranked player He's in a, one game. A beast, a different kind of beast. <laughs> I almost four stock Brub before getting reverse four stock. Dang. <laughs> what happened? Uh, I stopped being skilled Alex Firewind. <laughs> <laughs> it was over. What happened to your skill? Where'd it go? I don't know. I really would like to you find just, out. It just like disappeared? <laughs> yeah. Um, you, just, you just like look down, it's like my skill is gone. <laughs> Yeah, where'd it go? Where is it? <laughs> you look at your controller. <laughs> Maybe I'll find it in amateur bracket smoking. today. Who knows? <laughs> well, Artie's kind of just like... I'm not going to say he's molly -whopping, Yeah. But he's molly -whopping. Yeah. Well, I there was a tournament in uh, in New York called the molly -whop. Really? Yeah. That's funny. Yeah. I it feel like... Half of these kids here don't even know what a molly wop is. What? Wait, what is a molly wop? I thought it was just like a, a saying. It's like you beat somebody up really bad. Yeah, that's. Yeah. Oh, I thought it was like an actual thing. It, well, I mean, it's an actual saying, but like it's like internet slang from like Ooh. the 2000s. Like. The 2000s. You're telling me Toontown veteran knows what a molly wop is? Whoa. You know what Whoa. hurt me why, today? Why we, why you know what hurt me today? Singling people out. Because Toontown veteran. Oh, said, take off the shirt! Let's go! Let's go! Yeah. All right. Oh yeah. It's, it's serious time. It's, it's serious he, time. <laughs> he, <laughs> he flips off the crowd. He always does. He doesn't it's, like the attention, but yeah. he it's it's a show every time. It's a uh, you know it's a, it, he's crying he's crying out. But anyways, back to what my story was. <laughs> Toontown veteran yes. earlier today said that they got a bottle flip on their first try in second grade. They got what? A water bottle flip on their first try in second grade. I thought you said that he, that. <laughs> I thought for some reason that you said that they got bottle fed until second grade. No. And I was like, that's a crazy thing to say I was on like, the mic. wow, that means that you're really young because I remember being a lot older than in second grade when bottle flipping was a thing. I was in eighth <laughs> grade. And that makes sense because I'm six years older than T-Vet. T-Vet? And you were probably in college with bottle flipping. <laughs> Was it, was I? In college? I don't know. How old are you again? When when, when was bottle flipping? When, when when was the peak of bottle flipping? Probably when I was in eighth grade. No, like what year? Ah, uh, like 2013, I think. Oh, 2013. What a time. No, no, no. it was, was not peak? 2017. It was not. Okay, we should go look on. My point is, Tvet did it in second grade. Yeah, but this is. N now, now we have conflicting information. This could be 2017, could be 2016. Just graduated high school and did it in second grade. Tvet just graduated high school. Yeah, that's crazy. I remember when Tvet was a wee lad. I'm never saying that again. No, no. Uh, Tvet used to come to Hog back in the day. Um, like 2017, I was a senior in high school. That's really? four years after the peak of bottle flipping. Four years after. <laughs> I don't know. I uh, I personally think that bottle flipping never really had like a peak. It hasn't even peaked yet. No, it definitely did have a peak. <laughs> no, no, I mean, I mean, it was just lame the entire time. All right, so Roby is doing a lot oh, better yeah. this game. Back to the match. Not weighed down by the shirt. Yeah, that's what you know. Taking off the shirt, I think that's something that everyone should do to get better. Men, women. Those who prefer to, to, to not call their gender, all of them should take off their shirts when they're playing melee. Oh! Let's go, Artie. Yeah, but a full rack. And now Artie's dead, so. I think Artie should. No, I'm, I'm, I'm just gonna stop talking. <laughs> I think Artie should what? I was gonna say, I think Artie should take off his shirt, but I don't think I'm allowed to say that on the mic. 
You already did. <laughs> already did. You already did. I already did, but yeah. Um. Anyway, um, it would be. Oh my God, are you bringing it back? Let's go. Yeah, it's gonna be really rough if Roby loses. This. <laughs> Bring back planking. When was the peak of planking? Oh. I mean, that was probably also like 2014. Like I, I would think. So like when you were in, in college? Nope, I was in high school in 2014. You said that you were a senior in college in 2013. No, I was so senior in means... high school. I was senior in high school in 2017. Oh, I thought you said that you were a senior in high school in 2013. No, I was in eighth grade in 2013. Gotcha. So you were a freshman in high school when when planking peaked. <gasps> no. Yeah. Oh, oh Roby, get the go down there. What are you doing? No, no, no don't listen to him. Oh my god. <laughs> Don't listen to him. He Artie was just floating. About. Like what? Like what was that? It's the that was scary a kill. Kind and now you're dead. You're dead. You're dead, Roby. You're dead. What are you doing? Just oh kill my. him. Oh! Please grab the ledge. There you go. Okay. <laughs> People in the crowd are like saying, "He's not dead. He's not dead." Y'all are old. Excuse me. What? When? When did you see bottle flipping? What? What grade, Nariel? Nereal was sheltered. Nereal probably saw it five <laughs> years after the peak. <laughs> so what you're saying is that like Nereal's like one of those sky, like like one of those stars in the sky where like you, what what you're looking at is like ten years in the past. Hayden, I tell you what, <laughs> dinosaurs are still around. Dinosaurs still walk the earth. What were dinosaurs like? Um. To eat. Oh, oh, I get it. Hayden is calling Peach and Sheik a dinosaur. Oh. Yeah. People did so much bottle. Have you ever seen bottle flipping in person? Yeah. Really? Yeah. I never seen it in person. I saw it today. Wait, really? Yeah, Lottie did it. All I, I all I've seen is like YouTube videos. A bottle flipping. I've never actually. So you've never even tried to bottle flip? No. Why am I missing out? I mean, no, but it's just like really weird that you never have. I just don't. And that you've never seen it. I don't real... see the that. That means that you're really old, dude. That means that you're really old. <laughs> that means I'm really old. Yeah. How old does that mean? Like, like <laughs> what age? Like probably like I don't know, 29. Ooh, that's really or old. older. Dang, that's really yeah. old. What? I mean. Are you are you oh. <laughs> you saying that 29 is old? Yes, comparatively to a lot of the people here. A lot of the people here, like yeah. who? Like me. Oh, yeah. Who here is is older than 29? Artie. And let's know. let's end it there. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> um, that, that guy that was here playing. Tommy. Tommy? Star Wars Battlefront 2, that guy is older than 30, I don't know. Yeah, he's a kid, therefore he must be old. <laughs> Tommy's actually 38 years old. <laughs> Wait, who's Tommy? The the guy that just beat the brakes off of Brub. Wait, t wait, Tommy won that? I wasn't watching because I was playing my match. Yeah. So, I heard the lore that Tommy is here, but everyone else came because they wanted to beat Tommy. Apparently. To show, to prove that he's not that good. I came here because I like to go O2 and commentate, apparently. <laughs> That's just what I sign up for. I mean, I like to commentate only with my friends. Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> yeah, I don't know what I'm doing here. Yeah. Um, was that a stitch? No. You don't need it. Yeah, he he needs it. It's it's almost an even game. Oh, grab ledge. Never mind. Don't 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 listen. Nah, to we don't we don't grab do ledge that. again. Grab ledge again. Down smash. Oh, down down smash is clutch. Oh, back air, back, back air. air, back air again. Do it again. Do it in. Oh no! Tried what? Tr tried the reverse crazy. hit of forward air. It didn't work. Wow, went went for the crazy stuff. Oh, that should do it. Grab that ledge. Should do it. Get oh no, just, oh oh my god oh no! My god. It's over. It's over. <laughs> yeah, you don't deserve it. falling apart. Shambles. Uh, put your shirt back on. 
<laughs> Imagine the power only comes from taking the shirt off instead of. So like he just puts it back on and takes it off again and puts it back on. I think anyway. I think it is a valid strategy to be honest. I mean, yeah. Like how many people have you ever seen take the shirt off and then put it back on and then take it off? Immediately? <laughs> it never happens. Yeah. I All mean, right, there you go. Yeah, there let's we go. go. Let's go. Power power came back. Got the mojo. You know what they say about skilled Roby? <laughs> skilled Roby can beat Artie. <laughs> <laughs> skilled Roby can beat. No no no. Uh, shirtless skilled Roby. Oh yeah. No yeah. Shirted. Roby's not skilled, so yeah, that's that's what. There's a uh, there's regular Roby and then there's Super Saiyan Roby. You know what I've never seen? I've never seen Roby take off the shirt off stream. <laughs> it's only off. I've stream. only seen it happen on stream. I mean, where where would he take it off? I don't know. Like he's playing off stream against Brub, and he's like, "Fuck, I gotta take the shirt off." Never happens. I see. I was like thinking that like you know he wanted some privacy when he took. Like, but I think he usually plays like a set on stream, loses one game, and he's like, "Well, I gotta take it off." <laughs> so by the time that he would get to a set where he would need oh. to take it off, it's already off. Oh no! Oh man, yeah, already overextended. Claw his way back into this game. Roby has to figure has out a way not to just get here. hit by, but Woo! just down smash Armageddon right now. Roby needs to needs to think more. Oh, Artie's bashing? Didn't matter? How do you mash? How do I mash? Oh. Wait a minute, that's that's it. Not if he doesn't grab the ledge. Never mind. Okay. So Forward air. Oh. oh my god. Just grab ledge. This is painful. Oh my and god, like, Artie. <laughs> do you know Roby's that's like so triggered crazy. from last week when he lost to Bingy because he just like oh yeah I remember that set that was a crazy he set. just he just didn't camp so now it's like well oh after that let's go rock yeah rock is let's coming back rock. here let's go rock he took off the training weight now um, he's more powerful yeah what stage are they gonna go is Roby gonna go to Roby does not get to choose stage. Roby won the last game. Oh, I was just asking which stage you think Roby's going to go to. We're going to FOD. I, I don't, I don't oh know God. about this pick. Quick 59. I don't know about this pick. It's working out so far, but I... What don't you know about it? I feel like this is a chic favorite stage. Um, oh, no. But Artie clearly is showing that he is better at it. Right now, Artie... So. Artie's showing that he oh. oh got the turn up, threw it away. Electro man, what are you doing watching a, a non Fox set? Did Kiko Ho go? No. We haven't heard the name Kiko Ho in weeks. In months. Oh no! Artie, Artie said, "I'm gonna go find Kiko Ho." I went straight into the blast zone. <laughs> <laughs> a stream monster. That's scary. I don't. I don't know if I want there to be any monsters in. Yeah, the stream. I don't think we're allowed to have monsters in the stream. <laughs> I gotta check with with our with our stream, um, uh, night. Oh, little booty! Ooh, look at that back here. Oh, no. Oh my god! Bared this turn up. Down <laughs> spot dodge like three times in a row. No! Wow. Um. So, what is a, what is a, a good peach stage if, if this stage is so, so bad? No, I, I don't think this stage is bad. I just feel like Dreamland is just still the right choice. And Didn't they already I don't know, but already. Yeah, but already. Already oh lost. God. Already lost on Dreamland. Oh my God. Artie's clutching it up. Clutching up. But yeah, right I mean, now. I guess Artie just really likes the stage. I think he's the most comfortable on it. <gasps> oh my so, God. Yeah, I mean, Roby's going for it. He kind of. He just really wants to kill he here. He needs something. It's needs tough. To kill somehow. It's a tough situation to be in because yeah. you want to get the kill. You don't want to just get like a bunch of stray percent. Ooh. No. That's 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 the deal breaker yeah. right there. Yeah. Yeah. Roby not feeling it. Yeah. 
hate to see it go like that. Yeah. Especially in a game five. But. You know. Yeah. Aren't in conflict. Conflict. Conflict was saying that this is free for him. Um. Didn't they play last time? Went to game five, I think. Potentially. Potentially. Um, there's Arn on the left, and there's Conflict on the right. <laughs> Conflict has sure um, gotten smaller since last time we I, seen. I've heard rumor. Yeah? From Conflict. What? What's the rumor? Conflict is spreading rumors about Buzz Lightyear being <laughs> in attendance, so... Oh my god. I that think, means... I think we might be seeing Buzz play tonight. Buzz Lightyear is a whole different animal. Yeah. So a conflict whole might, different animal. Conflict might think it's a easy clap to be Arn, but Buzz Lightyear? Oh. Oh, it's back. Okay. That was scary. Kiko Ho told me in, in English that he might return to Hog and he lied. <laughs> in like English class? <laughs> Like, <laughs> like, like, he just told you in the English language, or, or language, or like, did like, he say it you, in Spanish? Can you imagine if like you're just sitting <laughs> in class, you're like, this sucks, and then, all you look over, Kiko is there, and you're like, Hold, oh, oh, what are you doing, man? And he's and like, he, I might go back to Hog. But he says Ooh. it in Spanish. Yo quiero ir al Hog. <laughs> Kiko Ho on stream, guys. Look, I already. Um, oh. All right, Buzz Lightyear up a full stock right now. I wasn't even looking to be quite honest, so I don't even know how that happened. <laughs> he did it at light speed. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh. But anyways, what I was gonna say is, since Buzz Lightyear is here today. Yeah. He might have just been in the frame and we couldn't see because he's so small. Yeah, he's so fast. <laughs> I mean, uh, small. Um, but he's, I think Buzz going. is getting killed here. Nah. Never mind. He's no, Buzz, wait, no. He's Buzz he, Light he can fly, dude. Buzz Lightyear can fly. He got those wings. I'm really glad that he actually used the Buzz tag. Because <laughs> <laughs> cause now we don't seem that crazy. You know, Buzz Lightyear. Oh, what was that? Oh my God! I want to see a, a freshman salty sweet. Someone explain the meme. Do you want to explain about the meme? about Buzz? Um, so at Giga Hog, I think it was the last. Was it the last Giga Hog or the one before that? Um, at one of the I don't know. more recent Giga Hogs. Uh, oh, I know what you're talking about. I know what you're talking Conflict about. Conflict yeah. just got super drunk and then beat. Wait, wait, wait! Buzz, buzz, buzz. Yeah, buzz. So it. The the nickname Buzz Lightyear was coined for it. Well, for a drunk uh, conflict. Let's let's put this in another way. There's there's a sweet spot. Yeah. Because once once Buzz <laughs> gets too buzzed, it's it goes. The oh opposite yeah. Direction. I mean, if he if he gets too buzzed, <laughs> then he's losing a crick. Yeah. Um. But but, but if it's but the if, right if combination. You're just before. If you're just before yeah. it, then you can <laughs> then you can be. Um, the buzz goes <laughs> wild. He's really like one of the best players in New England. Yeah, uh, honestly, best players in the world. It's it's crazy. Yeah, it's just it's hard to it's hard to contain. Honestly, the buzz. <laughs> he honestly, once he gets to that point, he's in infinity and beyond, dude. It's it's over. <laughs> he beat Tori at a hog. Yeah. yeah. Uh, I agree, cause it was at Giga Hog, so it was too. Yeah. Tournaments for the Connecticut PR accounted for two tournaments. Oh yeah! So it should be two wins. <laughs> um. Yeah. Yeah. Um. Oh, are we starting? All right. Um. Alex walked away. Um. So he doesn't want to see the buzz. Um. Oh, they're looking at Pokemon cards. All these Puff players looking at Pokemon cards. It's crazy. Um, so, looks like Buzz Lightyear trying to take the stock. 
But uh, Arn is Arn's on, on top of it, staying up in the air. Up, oh, now Arn's off stage. Oh, made it back on the stage, got the up throw, up air. Oh, tried to get the connection, but didn't work. Um, now we, now they're doing some neutral. That's some good neutral right there. What if there was a microphone and deck that he's on? What about that? What if there was a set and Arn was up to a... What about that? What if Conflict took an early lead in Game 3? What about that? Again. What if Arn up through Conflict to top plat? What about that? What if he got a kill off of it? What about that? What if he down threw F-Smash in the corner, but Conflict DI'd out so it didn't connect? What about that? Are we seeing Marth tonight? Yeah, I'm gonna play Marth. The thing about Hog is that it's characters that I have to play Marth against. That's what they don't tell you. Oh, what if Conflict drop ledge laser? What about that? What if Conflict DI'd in the death dimension? What about that? See, the thing about that is I would rather not play Marth. I don't want to play Marth. I, I play Icy's for a reason. I switched off Marth for a reason. But here we are. The crown is more important than one's self-joy. What about that? What if back air F smash to cover the ops attack? What if F throw? What if up the off the tech chase because Marth can do that? What about that? Um, Arn up two stocks to one. Arn looking to close out this with a nice little edge guard. Doesn't quite get it. Conflict answering back at the ledge. See if Arn can find a little opening. Throw him off stage. Just close it up here. Nope. Conflict finding an opening of his own. Doesn't go for Randall. Some might have thought that he would. He's on Randall and he's dead. And that's the set. What about that? What if Arn 3 would Conflict? What about that? And what if I had to play Tommy? What about that? Look at my shirt. It was too warm in here. I brought a sweater. Um, but 
but it was too warm for the sweater, and I brought a shirt, so thank you, Crike, for the shirt. Money can't make you happy, but ice climbing can. not What about that? I think I have to play now? Artie's gonna type in the chat and be like, yeah, you play now. Oh, my, my little guy is sideways. That's so hard to do. Uh, there you go. It's me. Goodbye. Thank you, Artie. Alright, I'm on the mic. You got me for the rest of the night. Because let me tell you, I am out of the bracket. But this isn't about me. This, this is a big set. This is a massive set. Because there's history already between these two. Oh, <laughs> we're doing that. Oh, yeah. So a little history. I'm pretty sure this was GGRI in Rhode Island, if I'm not mistaken. That was where we, we learned about this Tommy, though. Uh, maybe it wasn't GG, all right. Anyways, there's a tournament that these two... Yeah, 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 my bad. Yukon, Yukon! You're so right, bestie, that's my bad. Yukon! Shout out to Yukon. They're coming out here in droves today. So yeah, at... Ooh. The Yukon local, you come, if you will. Beckvin and Tommy were both there. And last I heard, Tommy got a little double Elim. Double Elim on Beckvin. So Tommy already making a name for himself. Young Gun, 18, I believe, is what I heard. Not that. There's prodigies everywhere. There's cathedrals everywhere for those with eyes to see. Yeah, that'll be a little early. Uh, interesting dual main. A little puff. Oh, I love the tracking, but didn't quite get there. So yeah, puff fox. Uh, Self-proclaimed says the puff is better. It probably starts off with puff. Fox might be a backup for certain matchups. <laughs> Kevin went home and played 30 sets to get master on ranked with Marth. All right. We'll see if it paid off. He plays Fox or Puff. Ooh. I should have picked Puff then. Uh, I don't know. I mean, this kid's definitely better than me. But uh, I played Tommy today. I got 3 0'd. The closest game was with Luigi. He is a self proclaimed Luigi hater. But regardless, last talk. Who's going to set the pace? Who's going to get the momentum going? 
But yeah, I like his puff uh, a lot. He's cool. Got some. Ooh, ooh. Yeah, he's smart. Which is what you need to do. He doesn't. That. That Nair killed him. Pace setter, so real. And Tommy, so real. Beckvin, uh, unfortunate Nair. Nairing past the ledge, getting caught under there. Maybe could have lived if you side B right after and then jump back, but even then, Tommy's gonna be all over your ass. So Tommy, drawing first blood. Crazy tag too, when you just go by your name. I assume that's his name. Maybe he's pulling a me and Tommy isn't his real name. I assume it is. Yup. Can't be grabbing. How's the DI? Not great, but doesn't matter. Ooh, yeah. Tommy definitely looking for the up tilt after that back air. Nice tipper from Beckman, though. Bringing this one right back. The rest... Ooh, that's um one small person profile I've noticed. Tommy, big on the pounce. In neutral. out To get out of neutral. Another one there. Ooh, roll in. <sighs> Dude. Nice. I like the choice of side B from Beckman there instead of grab. Grab was getting... Crouched for sure. Oh yeah, I played Brub, huh? Yeah, okay. Oh. Beckfin looking to the skies. Saying, yeah, I gotta play a puff. No one enjoys playing puff. I played a lot of puff today. Ooh. Non tipper, it doesn't matter though. Beckfin, despite the frustration, still keeping it close. So, yeah, I. <sighs> Mm, I feel like there are times. Oh my goodness. Yep. Uh, Loki, good DI from Beckman to just die as soon as possible. Uh, hold up! Please! <laughs> Frank, Kevin locks in. Yeah! But I heard Tommy moved to Connecticut, I think, from New York. Or unless he is just is New York. So I don't actually know. I'm not super well versed in the Tommy lore. There's a lot of chit chat happening in the Discord over Tommy. Okay, nice. So hopefully Tommy will come out more. Always great to see young talent coming around. Don't roll in, please. Oh no, grab Z should always grab. Rub club. Yeah. They are scrapping. Ooh, Beckvin missed the dash back, but it didn't matter. Oh, that trade is so good for Tommy. Ooh, kept the jump, though. Smart from Beckvin. That's good damage. Not going to quite be a kill, but this is really anyone's game. Oh, swinging for the fences. Tommy trying to maneuver in. Beckvin. Oh, that's a big committal on the down air and the jump. Oh, Tommy fully in it. Good swipe away. Dude. Man, two crucial SDs. Not how you want to go out if you're Beckman. Oh, we're going Ice Climbers FD. Yeah, wasn't... I mean, it was still close with the Marth, but... Now this matchup... This matchup... Yeah, it sucks. I mean, Puff wins, but it sucks for both. Uh, we got... This is definitely a... Oh, hello, everybody. Oh, yeah, you got the circle. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is definitely a uh, bad matchup <laughs> for both parties. Yeah, Puff definitely wins. Um, it's just oh, it's... really slow and droning. Yes, it is a slog. Because, you know, Puff doesn't want to approach on the ground ever. Nope. Wants to space back air, like, very heavily. And then... You know, Icy's Icy's, never wants to approach really either, to yeah. be honest. And also, Icy's notoriously doesn't have the best aerials. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, and Tommy showing off the rest early on to kill Nana as well. Good trade. If you can kill Nana with the rest reliably, might as well. Uh, it probably was a good trade in the moment, but right now, uh, Beckman is so po, definitely putting in a, a lot of work. Yep. I have this theory that. When Ice Climbers players lose their Nana, they get better. Like, they just start playing crack mode. Whenever, I believe it. 
Okay. Well, because you have nothing to lose at that point. Yeah, exactly. You might as well have but, lost stock already. Like, I feel like they're because they're not having to babysit Nana all the time. They just start moving and grooving. Schmoving and grooving. Yeah. So big fan. That's ooh, good back air from Nana actually. Oh, Nana, definitely not clutch right there, but... Nope. But yeah, Beckman taking it to FD as well, obvious pick. Tommy can't sit around on the platform. Wow, Nana got that grab. <laughs> I, I'm shocked. Yep. Okay, that should be dead. All right. Okay, huge, huge lead here for Beckman, although one rest can definitely... Oh, Nana with the jabs. Just those pounds again. Now... Tommy's pounds, I think, are actually more useful in this matchup because if you do the rising pound on the shield, I mean, you do get punished. But ooh, oh nice. wow! <laughs> yeah, Ricky, does. you should come back. Yep. Shout out to Ricky. Okay. Now, this one looking good for Beckvin. Definitely he... a huge lead right now. You know. Ooh! Ooh. <laughs> yeah. Sometimes, sometimes even. Even when the matchup is bad, I mean, if this is just your better character, sometimes it'll just work out better. And I guess, I guess Icy's, you know, even if you get the grab in center, you know, it's a 50-50 whether Nana's going to do down throw or up throw, I think, right? I think it's a 25 because she can do any throw in center, I thought. Oh, I see. I definitely, okay. She can definitely up throw. Yeah. Well, she up throw, well, against Puff, you know, you don't really need to bring her to the ledge because up smash kills yep. pretty early. So I think... Okay, any throw, yeah. <laughs> yeah. And I think the only throws you really don't want is forward throw, right? Actually, forward throw you forward can still do it off of, yeah. right? Whoa. Yeah. Let's see what the center is like. Ah, uh, mess it up. Ooh, that still, pound. Yeah. Huge percent, though. Yeah, really good percent. And now the impetus is on Tommy to approach, which is not what he wants to do. Yeah, definitely not what Puff wants, especially in a matchup where the character has actual kill confirms against you. <laughs> yep. Yeah, and Beckman also not going for super crazy handoffs, doing a lot of pseudo wobbling. Oh my goodness. Well, when up smash kills, you don't really need to do crazy handoffs towards the ledge. Yeah. Like against a lot of other characters. That is true. Ooh, I don't know. I don't know. Beckman going for sliding down smash? I feel like up smash actually covers a lot of space. I've seen some ICs have some good success with Wave Dash up smash in this matchup. Uh, so did uh, Beckman play Martha first two games? Yep. Okay. And lost both of them, so... Yeah, the the change up. Uh, oh. Just barely missed the up smash there. A little jab. Ooh, these aerials from Tommy are actually really unsafe on Beckman's shield. Yeah, uh, he, uh, he's definitely getting... I feel like he's getting a little nervous here. Definitely, yeah. Definitely doing some bad approaches. Oh, there goes... There's Nana. Now Beckman's gonna go crack mode. Um, technically, that's Popo. <laughs> true, true, true. My bad, my bad, my bad. Oh, what a clank. Let's let's see if uh, Beckman can get some percent here. Uh, oh. Looking, you know, back to center here. Two percent. Tommy just <laughs> F smashing. Oh, they, they're trying to scrap. I mean, Beckman extending this. Ice block, yeah, not quite gonna do it. Not, not like a crazy ton of percent, but still. Anything is better Anyth than nothing. Yeah, I mean, you basically have lost your stock already, so might as well get some extra. All right, Tommy going for these fade back nares. I don't know, it doesn't get a whole lot. Maybe just trying to get a little percent to set up a rest, but I don't know. Resting ice is... Resting ice, actually, that's probably really good because if you hit the main climber, the partner climber is probably gonna jab you or something and get you out of it immediately. Yep. Yeah, Tommy also kind of getting thrown off. Ooh. Ooh. Just getting hit by the other climber uh, a lot. What a, what a reaction. <laughs> Head in hand. Yeah. I mean, that's why this matchup is brutal for both of them. It is brutal for whoever is down. Getting the first hit in the first interaction at the start of the game is actually so huge in this matchup. Ooh, those were some crazy jabs by the partner climber there. <laughs> yeah, like a lot of these aerials, I don't know. Tommy's just holding in and just getting it's, whacked it's for just, it. Oh, uh, there's a grab. Oh, and try to, try to do platform tech chase. That's really funny. Yeah. Uh, oh, Nana gets oh, back Nana. to... Or Sopo. <laughs> or Popo. True, true. It's Climber. It's the climber, the partner, partner. climber. Oh. 
Yep. All right. Good, good. Uh, the up throw so Nana can drift all the way back to stage. True, yeah, that's smart. Ooh. Oh, that's gonna Best do game. it. Back Absolutely in. domination, to be yeah, honest. Yeah, honestly, was not close. I don't know, Tommy holding in on a lot, getting no rest, getting just, no setups. Just really, really doing high aerials on shield, just can, not drifting back after them. Yeah, not drifting back. No rising aerial drift backs, no short hop aerials. He's just kind of falling in with the aerial and landing. And we're going to Pokemon. Uh, interesting choice. This is a pretty... Oh! No. Didn't go for it. Huge. This is this is definitely a good icy stage here. Yeah. I feel like Puff's going to die off the top real quick. Dude. Ooh. Yeah, <laughs> secondary climber is doing work. This time, it really is Nana, because Beckman is crazy and changing colors. I can't do that. Every single game I've seen has been a different icy's color. Yep. Yeah, it just yeah. feels like character... Being comfortable with your character. Like, the Marth, not working out for Beckman, but... Playing the true Playing main. Playing what you know. Yeah. Uh, Playing what obviously, you're comfortable with. Yeah, also, right. Tommy, I'm sure, has a lot more Marth practice than Huff practice. Or, yeah. excuse me, Marth, uh, Icy's practice. Yeah, this stage, probably not it. That this up smash is, probably would not have killed on absolutely Dreamland. Have killed so. on, yeah. I think this stage and Yoshi's are probably the only two that that kills on, to be honest. Yeah. So, Sopa up smash. Oh, went for it all. Genuinely not like a pretty bad trade. Like you lose one of your stocks, yeah. and the other person just is still Loses alive. Nana. Ooh, and Beckfin extending the lead here. Oh, Puff kind of almost at kill percent already. Yeah, and like that trade makes it so Tommy has to go in, you know? Yeah, because he's down. And ice climbers. And, oh. oh my God, he just grabbed three times in a row. Ooh, damn. Yeah, Tommy holding in. That's like the the aerial placement is not great. Like just kind of getting sloppy with it. Definitely. Beckfin also really good at just calling out where the drift is going. Yep. And calling out, like, just DI, just in general. Why am I subbed? Because you love watching <laughs> Hog, and you should resub when yeah. that comes up. Yeah. But if you have an Amazon Prime, by the way, there's a Hello. event going on. In fact, it's been going on for quite some time. It's called Twitch Prime. Oh yeah, you get one free subscription, and you should a use month. it on this <laughs> oh, right, right now here. on this clinic. Yes. Yeah, literally. That was so weird. The icebergs didn't come out. Yeah. I mean, this is brutal if you're Tommy because. Oh, uh, yeah, yeah. This is it's 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 looking rough here. Oh, grab. Yeah, I think. Yeah. Yeah, I don't know. Tommy just not respecting the climbers, honestly. Getting a too, little too loosey juicy. Uh, just doing such bad pounds and. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's the HFG. Well, I mean, all all climbers can do it. Yeah, but it's, it's the like... HFG. <laughs> yeah. I've... Yeah, like even that drill, you know. He's still susceptible to getting punished by the other climbers. There we go. All right. Wow, reverse. Ooh, handshake. Full handshake. Respect. Huge. Reverse 3 0 there. Yeah. So, clearly, Beckman is just much more comfortable in that match with this ice. Yeah, players. yeah. Yeah, and despite it being a worse matchup, play what you know. Play what you know and play what your opponent doesn't know. Yeah. Play what you're comfortable with, what you can move with. Which we should get a CJ. I don't know, go on like Craigslist. <laughs> Release 35 nice to win. No, it's a, it's more of a zoomer thing because it's about refresh rate. Yeah, and if you don't have, rate. If you don't have really, really, really good monitors, it's you can tell. <laughs> yeah, uh, yeah. I feel like it's the opposite. You're actually, gonna be young. Well, I guess you're talking about le legacy and how uh, we've been. Oh yeah, that's uh, fair, Hayden. We've come up on mon or on CRTs. Not liking ten of those things. Yeah, yeah. We did. Well, we didn't lug them, but we had to take them out of a closet at our university tournaments and put them back in every single time. Yeah, if that was you're, annoying. If your, like, university could, like, have a space near where your tournaments are held... Oh. Well, they called me, so... Ugh. Sorry, I was unwinding my headset. Hopefully you can still hear me. I was gonna ask you how his tournament was going. Oh well. My tournament was okay. I lost a lottie for the first time, but hey. Some you win some, you lose some. 
Military grade case for monitors and wheeze. Yep. Oh yeah. Woo, ice climbers, let's go ocean. I am an ice climbers enjoyer. It's too bad you can doesn't come out anymore. Here's a real one. But yeah, ice climbers. Coming in droves. Ocean, of course. Ice climbers. HFG ice climbers. Beckman ice climbers. I'm sure I'm forgetting somebody. Kez up. Who's here? Ice climbers. Where is Tukin these days? I don't know. I think he's vibing. I think Hog's a little far from him. He may have moved. He's closer to a border somewhere. Maybe closer to Rhode Island? Or maybe north? I don't know. He used to come to our Elm City tournaments in New Haven all the time. But yeah, this hog is a big hog. 28 people, I believe. Feels like a mini chilling in Stanford. Ah, okay, nice. Yeah, 28 people. Feels like a mini giga hog. Um, and, no. I don't know. <laughs> Let me think. Notable things that happened this tournament so far. I mean, that was a good win for, well, <laughs> A uh, little bit of payback for Beckvin on Tommy because Tommy, I'm sure you've heard the story, double Eland Beckvin at a Yukon tournament. He only does stuff in New York. Yeah, that's fair. Oh yes, conflict at Hog. You're sure right. And Arn as well at Hog. And no Nario, Sag. <laughs> but this has been a little bit of a storyline as well. Two for two at UConn? Wow, nice. Yeah, hopefully Tommy comes out uh, here more often. It's, again, always encouraging to see new and good players come out. I'll have to grind Luigi Puff a little more just to make him angry. <laughs> but yeah, speaking of storylines, last time these two played, Arn won. And it was two sets, too. That was, a, that was a 10 game affair last hog. So, it was not quick, it was not pretty. But it was in Arn's favor. But Artie, unscathed, unfazed, wheeling and dealing, rhyming and diming. Takes that first dog. Your favorite? Oh, wow. All right, three stock rule set. Yeah, Artie, definitely your favorite New England player's favorite New England player. I get where you're putting down Electro Man. No, it. <laughs> It doesn't roll off the tongue super well, but I get what you're saying. It's like your, your streamer's favorite streamer, you know? Your favorite streamer's favorite streamer. I get what you're saying. Or your favorite player's favorite player. I think that's easier to say. Chapel Ruin. So true. I have not listened to anything of Chapel Ruin. It's like who they said Germa was. Germa was your favorite streamer's favorite streamer. And I get it. Anyways. Maybe your favorite... Your favorite hogger's favorite hogger. Yeah, already truly the germa of New England Melee. We did used to... We gotta bring the skits back. I know there's a, a couple... <laughs> there were a couple of really good hog skits, I remember. We gotta bring those back. Yeah, that's true. Weewa does... Weewa is, is the most hog hogger. I agree. But regardless, despite that really, well, really early stock from both of them, Artie's got the lead. So the big thing was mentality for Arn last time. I remember him talking about it, how it would be funny if I won. He did go in expecting to win, right? Melee is a lot about expectations and your mindset, the inner game of Melee, if you will. And I think one of the biggest detriments, I know I'm monologuing here, but going in expecting a certain outcome, I think is actually really bad. Like, you should never let it enter your mind saying, oh, I just got to play this person. I'll just beat them and, and then what's my next matchup? What never about confidence? What is there to say about confidence? Like, is it, I, I think the is confidence, that a wrong amount of confidence? Think? I think the confidence is I will play my best, <laughs> you know? You think I it shouldn't be based on who you're playing, it should be based on yourself. Yeah, at least I get tripped up on it, because 
when that thought enters your head, oh, I shouldn't be losing to this person, I think it makes you play worse. Like, if, if you're, uh, maybe even in the middle of a game, you know, if someone takes a stock and you're like, it's ego, really, mm -hmm. is what it is. Like, I, I lost a lot today. It was close. Yeah. I feel like in my mind, I should beat Lottie, but I should never have let that thought enter my head. What what you characters know? did you play in that set? Uh, Falcon Ditto into a bunch of Puff. I see. Yeah. And it's like, oh, I wasn't playing well today. Whatever. Yeah, Lottie beat me today. You know? What was the second? It was 3 2. Okay. Yeah. I mean, full Johns. I feel like I'm not playing great today, but That's Lottie too beat bad. me. Too it's bad. just, you know? Better player today. You had a lot of game five sets today. I did. <laughs> I did have a lot. <laughs> yeah, I went game five with Cyber Bunny, went game five with Scroll. And then in my mind, I could say, oh, and, and this isn't like, you know, me being like, oh, I'm a better player. It's like in the past, I've beaten these players, and it hasn't been this close. And yes. now it's getting closer. Maybe you're getting but, worse. You're regressing. <laughs> no, I think everyone else is getting better. But I can never, it's just, I don't know. It's you gotta step it up then. I don't know what to tell you. <laughs> no, no, I play this game. Just like, fun. that's the other thing. Arn has to step it up right now. That's true. It's Enough crazy. Already won game one in a set between the two of them that, that we're both commentating right that now. That is that's true. <laughs> that was the script last time. It felt like the Twilight Zone. It was so long, dude. That was a 10 game grand finals. Look, uh, winners Ooh. of their you know their bouts last week yep. already also won. So Yeah, they definitely played three sets last time. Which is brutal. But Arn's trying to make the magic happen again. Yeah, speaking of expectations, everyone always expects Artie to win all the time. That's it. Artie's got, like, I feel like the... Artie's been taking L's. Yeah, but I feel like he's... Because he's been at the top for so long, he actually has the most amount of pressure out of anyone. Really? Well, like, obvious. Yeah, because it's always an upset when he loses. Not always. No, okay, okay. But, like, you know what? You get what I'm saying. When like, you're the top like dog... he has to maintain his peak. Yeah, it's an event when Artie loses. Yeah. You know? But, you know, he's got to maintain the... Yeah, at Hog. Specifically at Hog. Because that's where I see the most... This is the only tournament I go to. Yeah, I mean, Beckfin's here today. I feel like yeah, Beckfin would be that's, favored. That is fair. But, like, versus Arn and uh, all the Hog crew. Although, Artie does make Beckfin have to throw the Marth out there, which that is... Beckfin grinded up to well, platinum. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, well, that's because Icy's Peach is literally or did unwinnable. Get master? I don't know how. He got really far. He got a master, I heard. Yeah. Anyways, two stocks apiece here. Artie trying to maintain top dog status. And Arn. Nice. Oh. Not a kill, though. Kind of like a spicy turn up there, too. It was interesting. Yep. Warren getting a little frisky with these downers. Tommy gave Beckman the work at UConn. Well, Beckman kind of gave Tommy the work on this one. Let me tell ya. Ooh, nice edge guard. And now, victory is within grasp. It's true. Julia Child coming out. But Artie's unloading the pressure right now. Yeah, Arn able to get back to center stage though. Ooh, we're rolling around. Ooh, the kind of sloppy <laughs> here. <laughs> Don't worry about it. <laughs> Ooh, opening, but... Oh, the weight from Artie. That was actually a really good weight. Oh, no tech. Dude. Artie waited for Arn's landing option for like five years. <laughs> five whole years. Five whole years. Right on the edge. Game's terrible. Yeah. Nah. <laughs> it's alright. It's right. Yeah, it's okay. We've just spent like a large amount of our yeah, lives playing it. Yeah, I just spent it. ten years playing this game. It's a vibe. <laughs> People don't say that anymore. One day, like, I might be good. Who knows? It's true. If I just keep and playing enough. It's like uh, Gusto says in Ratatouille. Anyone can cook. <laughs> <laughs> I was going to segue that into the game, but right now, no one's really cooking. It's, uh... Yeah, it was uh, a lot of forward airs in <laughs> yeah, the air. Yeah, pretty even. This is a very methodical matchup when you get to higher levels. You know, it's a lot of neutral... A lot of Peach matchups are kind of like a lot of neutral, to be honest. But I like it. Ooh, already trying to chase down Arn's defensive option. <sighs> oh, mixed up the DI. You hate to see that. <laughs> Did a little float. Yeah, I would have got mixed up too. Yeah, yeah. 
I really I wonder like what goes on in Arn's head in the sets that he's winning against already and like what goes on in his head the sets that he's losing. Yeah. Because I feel like when Arn loses it, it really just feels like there's a lot of times where he just seems lost, but then when he wins, he, he's winning. Like Yeah. And it can happen in the same day, so I really wonder what that is. Or if I wonder if it's like to do with Artie's mental. Yeah, completely possible. I think I talked about this a little bit before when I interviewed Arn last time after you won. His mindset was like, oh, he went in without expectations. He was like, okay, I'm just going to play, you know, and then when he won a game, he's like, oh, that it would be really funny if I won another one. Or And then he thought, it would be really funny if I won set one. That was his mentality that he was talking about. So I think when he's at, when he's a little more looser, you know, when he, his flow state is when he's not thinking about the game as much, I think. And I think right now he's, he's actually thinking too much. Mm -hmm. You know? Somewhere in the back of his mind is, I won the last set that we played. I just got to recreate last whatever two happened. Sets. Last two sets. Yeah, I just got to recreate what happened there. And it's just not how it works. Every set is a new set. Yeah, I don't, it's sometimes you just got to tell yourself play. Yeah. And yeah, whatever so. happens, happens, but you just got to play. Yeah, I think he's just thinking about it too much. Or, I mean, Artie is very good at this game. <laughs> yeah, I would agree with that statement. You know. Maybe he already did a little VOD review. But maybe, it's not a maybe. Already definitely did VOD <laughs> review. No shot he didn't do VOD review. So, already maybe fixing the gaps that led to his defeat last tournament. Ooh. Yeah, it should be it here. Yeah. Return 3 0. Not that close. I feel like Artie only ever hits that turnip when it doesn't matter. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. There's, the turn up like hits. that set that they had last week, it just he missed every single time. Yeah. It was rough. Yeah, so Artie maybe figuring something out. Arn, gonna have to make it through losers. Oh, freshman fight night. True. Arn Tommy might happen. That'll be interesting. See how Arn's puff matchup. I'm pretty sure he, he likes, he doesn't mind the puff matchup, so. How'd your tournament go? Terrible. Oh. Uh, okay. Yeah. Who'd you play? Um, Roby and Jay Killer. Roby round one? Yeah. What? Yeah, this is how messed up this That's tournament was. That's messed up. That's actually I think there was four up. buys. And he's oh, not, yeah, because this is a big tournament. He's not good enough to That's... get the buy, so I played Roby round one. That's actually messed up. Yeah. I almost took a game, but... Mm. I yeah. remembered I could rest game three, and then that was a lot closer. <laughs> <laughs> yep. That's how it goes. Yeah, I got... I, yeah. But I'm, I'm developing. I think, I'm, yeah, I'm, I think it's doable versus Roby, to I'm be honest. I've gotten real close with Puff I've taken Roby. I've taken a game, but never more than that. So. Uh, yeah, I think I got game five, maybe last stock with him, with Puff. Wow. Well, but if only. He's good, though. Yeah, he's, he's good. A, he's a solid he, I player. feel like he's been playing well today. For the most part. Mm. He had a couple games against Artie that didn't look good, but then he, he really put it together and brought it to game five. Yeah, so. big, big upset for him. I mean, he still lost to Artie, but... Oh, okay. Yeah. <laughs> sure. Hence why Artie was yeah, yeah, playing. Yeah, yeah, Okay. So. I got you. But we got a little T-Vet Tommy action. Two T's yeah. coming out. We will see. Freshman fight night, as they say. Is this freshman fight night? Well, they, I guess so. They go to two different schools, but... That's true. They're still freshmen, so... Hayden, Hayden said it's fine. Are they? Okay, I'm down. I'm down yeah. for whatever. This webcam is great. By that, I mean... Oh! Wait, t this, conflict? It's my favorite time. The ad read. If you love Ultimate, maybe you don't like Melee so much. You might like Ultimate. Ultimate on my... Okay, never mind. <laughs> I got cut off. They're playing. Straight into it. Uh, TVN is pretty good at this matchup. Yeah, an up-and-comer in the Connecticut scene, and Tommy, a new person to the Connecticut scene. So, yep. we'll be interesting to see how this goes. Yeah, uh, I said it before, I said it again. Always great to see new people. Hopefully, Tommy comes out often. Yeah, I mean, I feel like he'll, he'll probably go to at least the Yukon tournament, so it should pull him in here. Yep. Because they do the carpools. Oh, yeah, TVN must have beaten conflict yeah. to get here that is a 
Very good win. Well, T Vet beat Buzz, and I don't know how far into Buzz. He oh, but oh, true. <laughs> yes, it wasn't conflict. It was Buzz the Lightyear, my favorite. All right, two shots of beast. Huge cough from Tommy. I beat Roby and then conflict. Wow. Oh. So All yeah, right. I'm on a, on quite the run. Yeah, Toontown's been, Toontown's been getting good. Let me tell you. <laughs> oh yeah, Toontown is moving really Ooh. well. I must say. Toontown made a bet with Buns. Oh, today, sorry. yeah. Um, Buns paid for to Toontown's bracket. Oh, nice. And if Toontown did worse than Buns in the tournament, then Buns would get paid for the next tournament. But oh, okay. Does not appear to be the case this time. Mm. So it looks like TV got the free entry. Nice. Um, right. Surprised we're not seeing the sponsor tag, to be honest. True. A little sus. Yep. Maybe, maybe whatever that emoji is supposed to be. <laughs> Represents buns. Yep. All right, Toontown, Loki playing this really well. Oh, oh, yeah, wasn't nice ready. Smash. Oh, we'll get to ledge though. I mean, to stage. Well, nice drop I down. Said, back I said here. it when I was commentating with Artie. Mm. Fox should never come back to the stage if it's against Puff. Puff should always edge guard Fox and kill. That's it. true. Artie was skeptical, but. <sighs> I'm talking Ooh. about optimal melee here, like that. That's optimal melee. And it's right even here. run up, up smash. Oh. No. Okay, 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 okay. That was crazy because Artie said you should just run all the way to to puff and just go for the up smash. But I guess he just didn't have enough time to do it there. I think Toontown but messed, he up, might the have messed up the tech a skill. little bit. Oh. Oh uh, yeah. Oh. Wow. Not able to finish it the tech and able to get out, but a really tough scenario with all the grabs and. Text, yeah, just not Toon able to get out of the the maelstrom. Man. Yeah, Toontown was playing so well, playing keep away that whole set, but then the moment Tommy got an opening, just capitalized on it every single time. So big win there for Tom. Oh, that's not how you want to start. Yeah, that's not how one. you want to start game one. Yeah, pound. Honestly, this is my fault. <laughs> this is my fault too. I, I couldn't It's Hayden's top. fault. It's Hayden's fault. Oh Hayden, this is your God, fault. Yeah. This is your fault. Yeah, these pounds. Maybe I just gotta spam pound more. Tournament is different, you know? People get scared. People play different in tournament. They spaghetti. Maybe I'll just throw more of these out. Uh, Tommy is self proclaimed puff main with the fox as a secondary. And I believe it. This puff? Pretty good. Is, yeah, quite good. Alright, second it up here. TV trying to make. Make it closer, but yeah. Oh, Ooh, uh, whiff. Yeah, Loki can't be missing those if you're. Yeah, that's just a fat sixty percent. Yeah, like you could have blown this game wide open of three-one lead, but instead, Tvet gets another shot. So we did on stream see Tommy play Brub and three-zero Brub, mm. and didn't really look very close, to be honest. Yeah. I mean, Loki, I do think Tivet is quite good at this matchup, but... Ooh, uh, getting a little desperate with the up smash, though. Alright, it's 3-1 regardless, despite the missed rest, so... Yeah. Yeah. What does Tivet do from here? Uh, the start of Game 1 was so good for Toontown, but... Yeah, it's, it's just tough because... Tommy is very good at getting the rest setups on Foxes. Yeah. Clearly has played a lot of Foxes in his time. Yeah, so. th this is the right... Okay. Yeah, I should have noticed this. Um, T-Vet counterpicked a Pokemon. I think that's a mistake. Like, I think FD is possible worst stage. I don't know. With the way that Tommy's been getting the grabs. Because it's not like Tommy yeah. gets the grab and then T-Vet DI's out of it and it's not a big deal. It's Tommy gets the grab... Even when Tiva gets out of it, he gets grabbed again. Yeah, these double grabs are actually going crazy. And, like, they're obviously not real either. Yeah. I mean, you can't... Ooh, just one time bomb. Like, you missed grab should be punished. Oh, my God. Oh, can't be DI like that off the pound either. He's just... Tiva's just too close to... Like, he needs yeah. to, like, use the space that FD gives you to your advantage. Yeah. Like Puff can't really approach very well on this stage, but 
it's not hard when you're puff if the fox is running right into you and getting grabbed yeah. and getting hit by forward smash. Yeah, I was gonna say, T-Vet not really... Yeah, letting puff approach is usually the way to play it because puff approach options aren't great. Fox is really good at shutting them down, but yeah, I'd agree. I think T-Vet actually going in too much, especially at the start of rounds. Yeah, but... and I wonder if it's just like playing puffs that aren't as good as Tommy and like you get used to like what like if you play me oh okay I mean that I do that's that. not gonna that's oh, something I do that's yeah kill. I, I did that to um, scroll today actually oh really <laughs> yeah raw phantom rest all right one more chance for two down now when you're running into F smash yeah that's gonna be it 3 0 and what yeah yeah it's I think Tommy just eats foxes for breakfast <laughs> yeah <laughs> Yeah, it's a mental game for Toontown, too, because, again, I think game one, Toontown's got to go back and watch. I'm going to go figure out what's going on with my set. Because oh, are you I, playing? Well, I'm waiting for the winner of Feed J-Killer, but I commentated two sets in the meantime, so I don't know what's going sure, on. Sure, I mean, that, yeah, it's pretty quick. All right, we'll be right back. All right, well, I'm still around. Oh, my favorite. The ad read. All right, as I was saying before, we got interrupted by that set. Monday, Monday Fun Day, Super Smash Brothers Ultimate. If you don't like melee, I don't know why you wouldn't. But you know, some people play Ultimate. That's fine. Tuesday, we got a traditional Fighter Day. Some Tekken, some Street Fighter, Grand Blue Fantasy versus. That's the one with the big guy with an axe, I think, and the grappler chick. Anyways, I never played it, but I seen some stuff of it project plus um atticus was asking about it it's on wednesday rivals of aether probably rivals of aether 2 when it comes out thursday that's today a little super smash brothers melee oh and we're getting right into it i couldn't even tell you what happened on friday it's anime fighters anyways have we i come back and we i see have we bombed kiko's house yet um i don't think we've done that yet i could be wrong though Ooh, dash attack. Ooh. I feel like Backfin definitely could have gotten that forward air. Wow, I can't believe I already got back to stage. This mic is still picking me up. Oh, sorry about that. Alright, as I looked away. I think the blue Yeti over there. Anyways. Oh! Alright, already... Wow, you pulled a turn up there? I that's crazy. And got a dot eyes, by the way. Ooh, I like that cheeky little counter. We already already fought a Marth today. Maybe already getting a little sick of people going there. Well, I guess it makes sense for Beckman to go Marth, but a lot of Marths. That's what I'm trying to say for Artie. We'll see how Beckvin differs from Arn in terms of approach to the playstyle. I'm pretty sure Beckvin has been doing well versus Artie with this Marth specifically tuned to beat Peaches. Dude, Artie is pulling these turnips in the corner and they look super unsafe. So what's up, Petricide? Wow, what an air dodge. Even already was a guest at that one. We got a bomb. Ooh, kind of spooky. All right. Yeah, Loki, good to just throw that away if you're Peach. Because I think bomb will... I don't think. It'll definitely kill Peach if you drop it incorrectly. Ooh, I like that from Beckman. Definitely intentional. All right, trying to get him with the floaty killer, but... Fair off the side. Beckman had a tuned veteran Marth. Town, true. It's like uh, Xavier Renegade Angel. God, I love that show. <laughs> People will play Rainbow Six Siege, but they haven't seen a rainbow since they were six. Siege. <laughs> I remember seeing that tweet. <laughs> Beckman got a tuned veteran Marth. Town. <laughs> You slumber, a cucumber. Anyways, I'm done with that. We got a game. 
Ooh, yeah. Little pop up there from Artie. Sending Beckman flying. <laughs> Man. Ooh. Yeah, already kind of getting sloppy there as well. I feel like in the, at this hog, a lot of holding in. People are drifting in, holding in after aerials. No one is playing the drift away aerial type game. People are trying to hit each other and they're trying to get in. All right, Beckvin. Oh wow, what a down tilt to interrupt the down smash. Oh, <gasps> what the fake battlefield? Already fake battlefield it himself. Oh my god. Whoa, Beckvin is trying to track down this princess. Oh, jumps jumps out. Dude, already pulling turnips in the corner. Beck. Oh, what a grab. <sighs> Wow, Beckman went for it all with that F smash, and they both did the day one option. The F smash and then the air dodge. Oh, what a power shield. That should be it. Oh, what a clutch from Artie. All right, Beckman's smiling. Oh, we're talking. What's, what's up, Buns? <laughs> ah, close one, but Artie... Eeks out game one. Game two, we're going straight to Pokemon. Oh, big down tilt, but gets hit by get up attack. What's up, Paladin? Yeah, that F. Oh, caught the jump with the F smash. That should be it. Yup. Holy smokes. Great jump read from Artie. That's some of that first stock, but. Beckman doing a good job just tracking down Artie, keeping him uncomfortable. Oh, nice dip through. Artie catching on to these getup attacks from Beckman. I don't think Beckman can be doing it. What the? <laughs> that was a forward facing slide off from Artie, like wave dash slide off. Crazy stuff happening here at Hog. Ooh, what a grab. Dude, Artie is in it. He's reacting to everything that's happening. Ooh, spacing was almost good, but Beckman covered him with another. Oh, don't look now, but that face, that face has seen surgery. Oh, and it's still fresh. Already grabbed that re. Oh, oh, oh yeah, but Z dropping doesn't make it work. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness gracious. Wow. Crazy interactions happening on this platform with the light shield and the slide off, let me tell you. Ooh, tipper fair off the top. So, despite the stitch face, Beckvin. Oh, already in the sh movement bag. Surprising to see, Peach, not very fast character. Ooh, that missed tech is actually crazy from Beckvin. These get up attacks. Alright, good slide off. Alright, Beckman with a little turnaround in the air. Oh! Wow. Holy smokes. I don't even know what to say. <laughs> these interactions are crazy. They are full scrapping. I mean, there's, there's moments in the corner where they're baiting each other out. But there's just a lot of action happening. Yeah, these F smashes. Oh my goodness. Artie is all over them. Yeah, dude. I don't know. Well, you know what they say. Clock is right. Broken clock. God damn it. <laughs> Anyways. Hacha. What if instead of Peach... Oh, what a time to have a turn... All right, Mr. Connecticut, what did I miss? Well, Artie just SD'd to lose game two, so that sucks. That happens. Yeah. Nice. <laughs> All right, um... Yeah? <laughs> yeah, really unfortunate SD. Artie was cooking, and then we're going to Big Blue. Nope, we're going to Dreamland. Going to Dreamland. <laughs> You're going to Big Blue. <laughs> <laughs> I wish. Yeah. Back, back in my day. Beckman's right. been uh, playing Marth this week. Uh, actually, to beat Tommy. Yep. But 
that didn't really work out. Went Ice Climbers instead and ended up winning. So yes. weird how this game is sometimes. But the Marth is nice and warm. Yeah, that SD, can't think about it, but still a brutal one. Yeah? Hey, you got to live with it. Yep. I don't know how Beckvin changes character color every time either. That's, to me, that is insane. Is that insane for you? Yeah, I can switch characters every game. I can't switch colors every game. That's crazy. Uh, Abel, I don't, I don't really know if any of us are qualified to answer that question. Oh, uh, I Puff. know that, he, yeah, definitely Puff. He plays Fox. Yeah, does War. not play the Puff Ditto. I think he prefers to play the Fox Ditto, but I, he, I heard him say that Puff is his favorite character, so he's definitely yeah. a Puff main. Yes, uh, indeed. All right, Beckman looking good in this game. Yeah. Honestly, another early kill from Beckman with the down air. Yeah. Looking like arm. Power of uh, power of Marth. It really is. I think that this matchup is actually pretty hard as Marth. I don't really. I don't really know how they play it. Like <laughs> if Peaches start throwing turnips and all that. Oh True. my god! Yeah, what do you, you do, even do? You do have to have some turnip counterplay, but. Yeah. Maybe it's more of a chump check type of thing. That's why Artie's really not doing it that much because. Because he knows that Beckman's going to be ready. I mean, Beckman being a, a very silly player. Yeah. Down down for all the silly parts of Melee. Yep. Always nice to see. Yeah. All right. But, yeah, that Game 2 SD just... It hurts. Yeah, it hurts. Nice Ooh, edge guard. That was a great edge guard. Kind of a, kind of a hill to climb here. Yeah, big commit from already on that edge guard, but makes it out, but... So a mm. lot left to do. Yeah, how does Peach get the lead back? I'm sure Artie will find a way. Artie's I mean, handsome movement. That's true. Immaculate ledge play. He's got it all. Oh. 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 I like the idea there. Yep. Not the worst counter I've ever seen. Yeah, no, I, I don't mind that counter. I think it's pretty good. Ooh. Yeah, already just gotta find a way back. Oh, there it goes. There's the counterplay. Ooh, the day one. I have smash your dodge. Oh, that was the Wiwa. Run through <laughs> F smash. Oh yeah. Oh, the dot eyes. That was pretty good. It's looking you good know, for Artie right now. Yeah, you, you asked. There it is. How does Artie get the lead back? And that's how. Artie gets the lead back. 196. Yeah, that's definitely helping. Not dying. One floaty killer and he's dead, but Marth Marthritis is real. Yeah, it is crushing. I've seen this versus Arn as well. 223, yeah. that is brutal. Once I am like past a certain percent as Marth, I'm like, all right, I can't die for a while. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Just hold shield and then it's fine. Yeah, if anything, start me off the stock with 250 damage. Yeah. Don't actually, but you know, <laughs> sometimes, you, sometimes it kind of feels that way, you know? Yeah. Ooh, 254. There. That is crazy. All right, now kind of a kind of a deficit here. Yeah, just like that. Already bring it all running in and grabbing. You could definitely Ooh. come back as Marth. Like, yep. like just like this. Yeah, the Ooh. Oh, that could have been. Oh. <laughs> Beckvin jabbing for their life. Oh, interrupts. <gasps> Down air. Down air. Oh. oh, got there. The DI was. Does he gone. have a jump? Does he have a jump? Oh, it didn't matter. Yeah. The dude. little pop-off. Yeah, during the recovery. Wow. I, that wasn't little. I heard that. That was a, <laughs> that was a knee slapper. I didn't slapper. know if that was Beckman I was hearing. I think but... that was Beckman. Wow. Little knee right. slapper. Already trying to mount that comeback. We're going back to Dreamland. Man, this is a this is a locked-in Beckman. Yeah. Normally, I feel like Beckman doesn't have to uh, have to try like super hard against his opponents. Yeah. Um, but. Artie, you know, Artie's definitely difficult. Beckman doesn't main Marth. This is a this is a Marth tuned to kill Peach. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> this for is like sure. the, the one matchup. I'm sure there's others, but maybe uh Yeah. I know Beckman when Beckman doesn't want to do the Ice Climber Ditto, I know. Uh right. Beck, Beckman bolt out Marth versus HFG. I do remember yes. that. But I think Jeopardy. yeah, no, playing your secondary, I think you you know what? You gotta try a little harder. Yeah. Oh! Wow! A down tilt, down smash. That's wild. Whoa! That Beck air dodge. <laughs> yeah, yeah. And Beckman is swinging. Oh, I think he might have tried the Z drop that. Yeah, into back air, I think. Wow! wow. Tipper. 
All right. And what can Artie do? Yeah, gotta hit these edge guards. It feels like Beckman's been getting back to ledge a lot more frequently than before. I feel like Artie, he's got his flow chart, but once the flow chart stops working, I think he tries it even harder. You know? Yeah. Um, because he knows he's making a mistake somewhere. Yep. But he keeps making the mistake. Yeah, it's just like a lot of you know the turnip drops into back air into maybe I'll grab a ledge, maybe I won't. I don't know. Right. Low key. Sit next to ledge and wow. rip a down smash and see what happens. Yeah. Every once in a while. You go, know? Yeah. Sometimes you gotta go back to the day one. Call oh. out their bad recovery. Nice. What oh. was that grab? Yeah. <laughs> Already did everything right there with the movement and the baiting out of the. Oh. Recovery option and Beckman just gets a grab. Oh, Ooh, wow. that's a nice. Oh, there that's that's what you want to see from these turnips. Yep. All right. Ooh, living. See, now we're getting yes. to maybe I'll get. Oh, them. excellent Arthritis. use of that. Yeah. Yeah, already needs to fight for this lead and maintain it. This is a horrible spot to be in against Marth. Oh yeah. Not much to do, but get swatted away. That wow. was really smart. What a pick up. That was great. Yeah. And just that, like that. That side B. We're even. Going crazy. Oh. <laughs> yeah. Ah, yep. Couldn't quite punish the air dodge. It's just, oh. Oh, that could have been, uh, maybe. <laughs> yeah. If I already messed up a little bit. Yep. Oh my god. Called that dash attack out. So oh. hard. Wow. I know napping on the job. Yeah, I'm just, I'm so much more afraid for Artie when Artie is off stage than when Beckvin is off stage. You know? Right. I just feel like Artie, yeah, I don't know, the edge guards haven't been there. And that's, yeah, I agree. That's huge. These would be earlier stocks. And that's usually a like kind of a struggling point for, for Artie against Martz, I feel, is mm. he doesn't really hit the edge guards unless, you know, unless they're giving him what he wants. Yeah. Ooh. All right, playing the patient shield drop game. Ooh. Wow, yeah. That air dodge. Wow, Ooh, that's got gotta be it. Yep. Okay. All right, see, like, there's one for Artie, but I feel like just, I haven't seen that many edge guards from him. Yeah. So, okay, living. You might see a game five. <laughs> Get to top platform. Wow. 7%. He has jump, yep. Oh, that's it. Oh, that was the. Grossest hitbox of up tilt, but <laughs> once I can piece, Artie has this to survive another yep. game on winner's side. Oh, oh. what a reverse up tilt. Oh, the down smash may be a little greedy. Oh, oh that up air <gasps> maybe. <gasps> that wow. could have been it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Loki, Beckman's DI on the first hit of Artie's strings has also been really, really good. He's been DIing out properly. Right. Got to. So Artie doesn't get as many follow-ups. Because Artie gets those big juicy combos off people holding in. Oh. Oh, yeah. sent the wrong way. Yeah, I think Artie's in a much worse spot right here. Despite being at similar percents. Yeah. Oh, that could be it. No. Nope. Oh, great DI. Yeah, called it out. But oh, Artie's just struggling. To... This is it. This is where it... Oh, it's he needs so to get back to He's stage. He's got to figure out something That's new. It? That's it. Wow. Little pop-off right. from Beckvin. I believe and I'm next. Ah. We'll see. All right. All right, good luck. All right. Missing reverse scenario. Yeah. Never been able to drop little clouds. So Beckfin is victorious. Yeah. Today's tournament, very stacked. Extremely stacked. Got the new kid on the block, Tommy, came out. Not Tommy Drowro, not Tommy Baby Powder, but Tommy Tommy. Tommy Squared, if you will, coming out. Wow. I feel like we're still somewhat far back in the bracket, but... We're getting Brav Arn. Right off the bat. Alright, no hand warmers. We're just going in. 
I feel like... And I'm not looking at the stats right now. Oh my god. I feel like this is one Arn usually has been winning nowadays. Could be wrong. No disrespect to anybody. Ooh, Brub is moving, but I mean, that first stock was... That DI on that F smash, a little suspect from Brub. Ooh, I love the crouch near stage. We are throwing it. smash attacks out. Oh, Brub is hitting a lot of buttons. Oh, oh we're playing a little... <laughs> they were both full gas until that moment. And now, ooh, the little jump back, but ah, not quite there. Jab, turn around, up tilt. That's the second time Brub has done that already. Okay, up there, up air. That will do it, but 86% to Brub's name. Jeez. Brub is moving. Oh, the second fair. That was really cool. I thought down air was coming for sure. Rising dare, but... Arn with a cheeky forward air. Gonna make it a clean stock lead, but... Brub is waiting for the option from Arn and... Oh, back air. And to the up B. Man. Again, that's that Arn efficiency. I always talk about it. He is so good at getting low percent KOs. When... Okay. Jump back shine. Brub's still in it. <laughs> As always, it's Fox. Anything could happen. Well, crucial that Brub got to ledge there. That's some crazy slide. Brub is trying everything in the book except a l unfortunate SD off the ledge. I mean, Arn was... Arn was cooking that game, truly. And it felt like Brub wasn't moving that bad, but... Pushing buttons doesn't always win games. These jab up tilts are really interesting from Brub, but hasn't met anything so far. Like, not as many drill shines, not stuff like that. Oh, that DI! Ugh, this is the second time! The F smash DI has got to be a little better. Yeah. Oh. Do I not? What do I do? Is it on? Yeah. Oh. It, yeah, it's always I thought on. I, had, I thought I had to hold a button or something. No, no, no. No, you're good. Cool. This is Bingy on the mic. What's Chris up? Christopher Bingington on the mic. Yep. So, game one goes to Arn. Yeah. Some sus DI from Bro. Oh, yeah? <laughs> yeah, off the F smashes, but... I see. Yeah, um... I feel like he was playing pretty hot today versus me. I mean, I think he's, like, had some time to warm up. Ooh, okay. Yeah. Um, I was gonna say, the movement from Bruv, really good, but... Yeah, it's more, DI. more than movement to win a game. True. That is true. What's up, Petey? <laughs> What's Ooh. up, E-Man? So yeah, if I'm not mistaken, I feel like Arn usually wins when it comes to these two. I, I'm not actually looking at the stats, but my educated guess was... Yeah, I think Arn usually wins these. I'm thinking just because of matchup. Does Tommy have enough time to get PR in CT? Probably not. I think the season is ending pretty soon. <laughs> yeah, I guess we would need enough like entrance well oh actually it, 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 it he will probably all right if november he attends, if he attends uh more um yukon tournaments because yukon well, is now gonna only count. only one of them is right I the thought, first yukon of the month is the only one that's counted i thought that they were going to try and make it so that all the yukon tournaments going forward counted oh and so that it, yeah like they just recently made this uh adjustment oh, know, okay to the uh, season yeah, right. so I think he's going to be able to make it. And I hope he comes out to more hogs. Yeah, that's what I'm hoping. For more information. Yeah. Damn, good stuff. All right, bro. Take Sorry game for two. not commentating. <laughs> yeah, no, that's all right. All right. Rub taking game two. And FD, no FD. surprise. FD. Yeah. True. Fox Marth FD. Yeah, Arn's combos are so clean. It's insane. Yeah, I... I will say, I don't feel like Arn is the FD kind of Marth, you know? Yeah, I think you're right. I mean, he dropped... 
Whoa! Oh, that was crazy. Well, okay, let's him back, but Whoa. that's all right. Resetting to neutral. You were riding me, but oh, that's unfortunate. Guns. Oh well. It's okay. It's always next season. He <laughs> sabotage, sure. Or you can find another ride. That's always possible. <laughs> yeah. All right, walk away, F smash. The Wee Wall Classic. Ooh, bear barely getting him. Alright, Brub makes it back. Yeah, good ledge dash. Ooh, Dang. still stuck in the corner though. Okay, nice. there's the bear, yep. Alright. We'll see how orange flowchart is on FD off the grab. I am curious. Yeah. Nice find by Brub. Alright, edge guard. Yeah. Nice shine. Nice, yeah. Wow. Brub's so good at edge guarding Mark. Dude, the spacing. Wow. <laughs> yeah. All right, here we go. All right. We'll chain grab. Yep. Re grab. Yeah. Nice. Yep. Up there. Yeah. Up there. Up there. Oh, Brub kind of not oh. dying anything. Yeah. Okay. Just goes straight. Re grab, oh, but Brub's got the jump back. Didn't use it. Oh. Didn't matter. Yeah. <laughs> Couple lasers. Ooh, there's that up tilt, but. Oh wow! Yeah, risky. Like I feel like, but for still does it. Or I don't know. It just felt like it didn't seem like uh, Arn had enough time to go down there and get that bear. But yeah, you know, he really he did. Yeah, yeah. it was definitely close. Yep. All right, on stage, back air, rinse it. Oh yeah, can't just sit there. But up the upper yeah. air is gonna do it. Up right there. Oh, up throw up air. Oh. Arn's gonna find a way down now. What an up tilt. Yeah, wow. Back air, back air. Oh, that DI was not great. Marn. Yep. Just like that. It's the no no zone. That's what Brub says. <laughs> He's like, can't be side beating there. Yep, can't be side beating, can't be jumping there. Oh, I like that combo. Good short. Yep. Oh, oh, what a shot! Wow. Oh, but yeah, that down tilt's gonna do it. Still cleaned it up. Yeah. All right, last anyone's stock. game. Yeah. yeah it's super even. Oh, Brub kind of oh, ran in the corner. The oh, forward throws. Forward again. Throws again. It doesn't matter. He's crazy. He's doing wow. it again. He's just pushing him to the other side. Oh, of the slippy stage. side yeah. B. Can't wow. be doing that. Oh, tries to get that. Oh, tilt. Brub That's is missing a lot of techs. Yeah. I'm trying to get out the corner. Oh. A lot of spaghetti here from Arn as well. Yeah. Oh boy. <laughs> Brub is playing. Oh, oh we lost the wallet. Just barely missing. Oh, oh, that was intentional. The jab up tilt. Holy oh, smokes! Oh, <gasps> this is the jab. Wow. But oh, Arn no jump. Up here. Yeah, that, that's that it. Smash. I think that's it. Just gotta. Yep. Jeez. Wow. Close. Game four. Yeah, Brub. What a win that would have been for Brub on FD. But. Yeah. So did they play on Pokemon or? I think they did. That's what game two was, right? Yeah, that's where Brub won. Okay. I think. Okay. And they started Battlefield, I think. Yeah? Yes. Okay. Yeah. All right. Oh, Jeez. massive tipper. Sheesh. <gasps> oh. Oh, another fair? That was, yeah, I was going to wow, say, that's so yeah. low. A little far. Unfortunate. Barely missing that sweet spot. Oh, that DI. Yeah. Mm. Yeah, Brub's DI, yeah. Definitely has been a little off, but... I mean, sometimes it happens, you know. Sometimes, sometimes, yeah. Sometimes you just get slapped and you're not expecting it. Yeah, that's fair. Ooh. In with it. These up tilts have been kind of crazy from bro. He's been doing jab up tilt, which, yeah, like, yeah, jab turn around up tilt, that's crazy. That is crazy. Oh, good slide off. So fast, dude. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Like, up how does he. Yeah. <laughs> Okay. It's like a quarter circle input, you know? Yeah. Oh, that smashed the rolls. Yep. Oh! oh I like interesting that. Interesting counterplay. I love it. Yeah. New Brub was going for that jump back shine, but. Yeah. Tournament winner. All right. Do it for R in there. Yeah, Brub also going Dreamland. Probably which just wants the Marthritis to happen a little more often. Yeah, I know Marths don't really like this stage, but I feel like Arn's the type of Marth that actually wouldn't mind it as much because he's yeah. more neutral based. It's true. 
Yeah, I could counter. Oh, wow. Ooh. I was just yeah. saying, that was actually a good up B from Rub, kind of far away, but Rub, or Arn still it, scouts it out. It looked like it, too, yeah. And then Arn, like, really got the tipper there. Get the back here. Oh, we're walking. Yep. <laughs> nice. Yep. Good shine stuff from Rub, yeah. Oh, yeah. Can't, can't side B there. Oh! Didn't get the jump back either. That's a yep. dead Marth, and that Rub. That is a dead Marth. Up a full stock here. Counter pick working out. Yeah. These up tilts. Oh, massive tipper. Yep. Oh, yep. Wow. The DI is just not there. That, <laughs> that, 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 that all started with really bad F smash DI. Yeah, dude. That edge cancel fair and down air. That was so clean. Yeah, that was really good. All right. Goes for the immediate. Oh. oh tries to clip him with the bear. Ooh. Ooh. Yeah. I don't know. Yeah. Oh, okay. Just double jumps the ledge. Okay. I'm so scared. Arn's wow. gonna rip an F smash. Dude, Arn's going for these forward throws. <laughs> yep. So, oh man. Yeah. Oh, that's, that's the no -no zone. it. Yep. The no no zone. Yeah. So, despite yeah. the spookiness off the F smashes, we're going game five. Oh, maybe they. Oh, Arn oh, going Pokemon. Back to Pokemon. Arn likes Pokemon more than Yoshi's. Unless they played on Yoshi's game three. I might be misremembering. Yeah, it may have been Yoshi's. I just, yeah, I can't remember. That would be a banger set, Abel. <laughs> I think that's the set that we're all waiting to see is Artie versus yep. uh, Tommy. Because before we had everybody else come out, we were like, oh man, we wonder if, Tom, if he'll beat Artie. But yep. I think we'll end up seeing that. So. Well, back when Artie did it, so. Unless Arn beats Tommy, but yeah. Oh, what? That was the insane. Down air covered the edge, can't the slide off rather? Holy! Oh, no jump, I think. Yep. Yep. The no-no zone, and three yep. stocks apiece. Yeah, I feel like Brub would really poor, like this one. This poor Brub. A... Sorry, I said Arn. If Arn beats uh, Tommy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. My bad. My bad. Now you're good. Oh, Brub is moving so well, but it doesn't quite get the punishes off the tech chase. All right, big trade. I mean, Brub up a fair bit of percent. Oh, <gasps> oh trades. Wow, okay, so it's even. Nothing actually <laughs> happened, it's, it's all good. Yeah, but I mean, Arn was down a little bit of percent, so okay, okay. trade for Arn, but. Yeah. Oh, Brub is moving. Oh, the grab doesn't quite overshoot enough. Just grabbing wow. the slide off. These grabs by Arn, oh man. Oh, the air dodge. Oh, just drills out of. Yep. Oh, that's trying to catch the landing. Dude, that side B is always so scary. Oh my gosh. Probably sharking, but not quite getting anything. Oh, what a down yeah. tilt. Oh wow. What a dash deck. The F crazy. smash. The yeah, DI the was not good. <laughs> Again, I hate to harp on it, but <laughs> I the F smash. Yeah. It's just not a DI day today. All, All right. right. All right. Last, last stock game Here five. We, we missed the edge cancel. Don't worry about it. This is where... <gasps> big grab. Big tipper. Yep. Just oh. Right again? into his loving oh. arms. <gasps> what a dash, dash attack. attack. Great tech from Damn. Brub, though. Oh. Get up attack. Yep. yep. Brub's just struggling to find a way in. Oh. oh hold up. Into Nair, holy. Wow. Opening yep. for Arn. <gasps> oh, I thought he was going for it. Yeah. Game five. Oh, boy. Didn't want to go for it. Oh, Brub goes high, just trying to live. Just trying to survive. Oh, I think I got the jump back. 150, oh! 163, what? Oh, that good smash. Yeah. yeah. Good stuff. Right. And it good would stuff be... to Brub. What a run. Yeah. So. Yeah. All right. Here we got Arn versus um, Tommy. Oh. So. All right. Interesting. Yeah. That should be interesting. Yeah, for Arn, I think he he doesn't mind the Puff matchup, so this will be interesting to see. I don't like this matchup as Puff, so curious to see how Tommy plays it. I mean, it's not bad by any stretch, but it's just kind of annoying to play as Puff. Yeah. You just get swatted around a lot. And you have to hold down a lot. But. Yeah, that's fair. <laughs> but it seems like Tommy prefers it to the Fox matchup, at least. True. And, uh, you know, he's been... Uh, Doing pretty well versus the Mars, you know, back then. And uh, I think he's actually been practicing for Arn. So, specifically. Oh, Tommy? So, Tommy, yeah. Ah. That's, that's something that he's wanting to, uh, yeah, do well in. All right, so we got Battlefield. 
Yeah, right off the bat, no hand warmers. Yep. Yeah, this is going to be tough for Tommy. I mean, I know Tommy's good, but I think Arn is, again, one of those Mars that likes to play it safe and is very patient. Um, yeah. He took Zuppy's uh, Falco. Fun fact, by the way, uh, I think game five. Arn? Um, yeah, it was either game four or game five at uh, Collision. Yeah, nice. So, yeah, Arn's pretty good. Yeah, I'm curious to see. These are the, the two prodigies going at it. Two young guns. Mm -hmm. True, true. The next yes. generation of melee, if you will. Yeah, <laughs> Yeah, super dope, too. But, uh, you know, we have a top-level puff <laughs> and another fox. You know, let's go. Yeah, that's true. So It's an interesting one. I mean, I'm sure... I think Game & Watch puff is also pretty fun. <laughs> yeah, I, I do. Yeah, I like that uh, matchup. I think, um, I think Game & Watch has some stuff against buff. Oh, yeah. Definitely. Ooh, S Smash. Oh! oh <gasps> yeah. I think it probably would have better just SD there. Yeah, I, mean, I, I don't think Arn probably, quite yeah. realized it, yeah. Yeah. Ooh, Ooh. nice up B. Good. Yeah, early up B. Ooh. Damn. Yeah, so next thing for Arn to learn is. Oh, I guess he's got those. <laughs> A good patience by Arn. Wow. Yep. Oh. oh, gotta get these pivots a little quicker. Tommy trying to <laughs> compose himself here. Rocking yep. back in a seat. Trying to lock in, but... Yeah. Ooh. Ooh, okay, that back here should do it. Yeah, Arn went a little too high up there. Yeah, this is why I don't like this matchup as buff. <laughs> Yeah. He just kind of gets swatted. No, for sure. The aerial superiority is not there. Right. And forward air. Yeah. Oh! Ooh, that's, yeah, that's All right. Be Shield breaker? Huge. Yep. Yeah, F smash, that's fine. All right, yeah, huge rest for a Tommy. Mm -hmm. Spot dodge rest. Oh! Oh, went for almost. it again. Oh. He's just <laughs> going yeah. for it. Ooh, good scout out of the pound too. That's a that's a player read because Oh Oh almost. But not quite. Man. <laughs> Arn trying to find a way in. Yeah, these yeah. pivot tippers gotta be a little quicker Ooh. on the draw. Right. It's hard though. It I've is never hard. I've never been able to do it. I have no clue. Double down. I don't think it's frame perfect, but it's definitely like a tight window. Yeah, I mean like dashes out of throws are always Right. Getting the exact timing. Not always the easiest thing to do. Oh, man. <laughs> F-Smash just barely missing. Yep. All right. Yep. Good patience by both of these players. They don't they don't mind waiting, and uh, it's, you know. Yep. That's what you got to do. Yeah, it, it's, it's interesting. I actually really love the patient play, you know, yep. the, the meticulous spacing that they're trying to deal with here. Oh! Oh. Dash attack. Doesn't quite get there, but... Yep. Ooh, what's the... Wow, it just grabs the ledge. And Tommy... Kind of bringing this one back after that rest. That was a huge rest to get. And the Marthritis, definitely not helping Arn out. Hmm. Yeah. Went for it all. All right. All right, last stock. One stock apiece. Who sets the pace? Oh, damage. Oh, oh okay. scout set out. Yep. Oh, kind of spooky oh. going down that low if you're Arn, yeah. Yep. Yeah, drill grab not going to work at that percent and didn't get the pop up either, or the backflip rather. That's yep. more damage. Yep. Arn just playing it safe here, walling out Jigglypuff with forward air. Yeah, no need to do. Oh! Oh, wow. Could have been spooky. Yeah, DI's that a little in. All right. The back airs. Oh, there's the back air. Oh, there's a trade. Yeah. Oh. Scary. Oh, that oh, nair was it. Yeah. not a doing that. great nair near the ledge. That's like the muscle memory nair. Uh, yeah, that's unfortunate. But we got good stuff to Tommy clutching yeah. it out. Tommy. Out patienting. 
Arn yeah. on that one. We're going straight to Yoshi's. Arn's had enough. Yep. Want to play a little less neutral, want to kill this puff a little quicker. Oh, oh that's, yeah. Big Not going to be a kill. Oh, oh yeah, just went for the rest like there, that. Yeah. Down smash. He's really good at whiff punishing oh. with these rests. Oh, yeah, misses the punish, unfortunate. Oh, that's, yeah, yeah. that's another rest. Oh, man. Yeah. Oh, no tipper. No there is also brutal. Man, rest. Hopefully, uh... <laughs> This isn't getting into Arn's head here, but yeah, it's hard I was not gonna say, to sometimes. Rest is so polarizing, and it... I don't know. Digging yeah. into the mental game against Arn, too. Absolutely. Yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah you gotta tech yeah. that. It's tough. Yeah, even if you do tech it, though, Puff still has a chance. True. If, yeah, if they no. Reaction, platform, reaction, tech chase, absolutely. Yep. Yeah, wow. Me. Grounded pound. The massive lead here. Yeah, I mean, it's brutal. On your counter pick too, it's, yep. it's a rough, just a rough one for Arn. Yep. Ooh, if that hits, we Ooh, live in a different world. Almost. I don't know what this guy's doing. All right, All not right. undoable. It's not over. Yeah, yeah I mean, anything is... can happen. Oh wow, double dash tech. Yeah, surprise. Tommy didn't just re-roll in there, to be honest. Hmm. Alright, Arn yeah. racking up some percent. All he needs is a tipper. Yeah, one thick tipper with bad DI. Yeah. That's alright. Oh. oh, that was, yeah. yeah. That would have been a good opportunity. <laughs> yeah, I think he um, slid off the stage, actually. Yeah. Me meant to F-Smash, for sure. I think you're right. Oh, up he's shield poking. Yep. Giving Arn another chance here. Ooh. It's tough. Yeah. Oh! I think that's it. Bad DI Hold there. Up. Wait a minute. Oh, the movement. Ah, ah, yeah. Good try from Arn. Keeping the yeah. head in the game, but. Right. All right. Down 2 0, but. Coming in, yeah. I mean, Arn's good enough to bring this back. Yeah. FD, I think this is the right choice. I I'm, think so too. Yeah. I maintain this is like a, this is probably Puff's worst stage in my opinion. At really? Least in, at least in Fox Puff, I think it's the worst stage. Okay. Yeah. But, I can see that. I mean, the dynamics of this matchup might be a little bit different, but. Sure. I know some Puffs like FD, but I don't mm. really understand why. I think <laughs> that they just, I don't know. Yeah. Anyway. Um, yeah, we'll see. Yeah. Yeah, Arn's always like off to a good start it seems, but. Somewhere down the line, like he rest. like overextends and <laughs> yeah. then gets rest or punished for it. Yeah. So, yeah, just have to play a little bit more, like I don't know, consistent with like composure. I don't, I don't actually know, but <laughs> yeah, yeah, it's tough. It is tough. All right, tipper off the top. Yeah, Jigglypuff punished super hard. So, oh, good Ooh, sweet nice. spot. Yeah, I like that recovery a lot. Yeah, Tommy's also been doing this specific bear. I don't think he was doing it earlier. It's like uh -huh. a, it's a full hop and then a fast fall falling back air. Right. And it's just it's coming down at an angle where I don't know, Arn's playing pretty grounded, like yep, a lot of like wave that. dash, a lot of dash dancing, and this back air has actually been hitting Arn and giving Arn a lot of trouble. Yeah. It just yeah, it comes out at the last second and I guess he's not expecting it because it looks like he's up and in yep. like, yeah, or up and out, I mean. Yeah. Oh, okay. Oh my goodness. Oh man, it's so scary <laughs> whenever you whiff a, <laughs> yeah. a, a smash attack. Alright, we're back to neutral. Yeah, Tommy not doing it now, but mixing it up a little bit. Yeah, yep. went for it there, you could see. Right. That full hop, a little bit of a wiggle. Yep. Uh, oh, okay. Gets away. Oh, oh yep. fishing. <laughs> Going fishing. <laughs> Bass Pro Show. Okay. How will Puff get down? Okay. Yeah. Oh! Ooh, Arn is trying to get this stock off. There it is. Yeah. Oh, F tilt. Tipper F tilt. 172. But, yeah, gotta be careful of your Arn here. You're still in rest, rest setup percent. 
That's really what it's True. about for Puff. At least when I ever, whenever I play Puff. Yep. It's about getting like one or two hits until your opponent's at like 15 to 30 percent, because then all your rest setups start coming online. And by all of them, I mean up tilt. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> right. Like aerial up tilt rest. The falling, falling back air, up tilt rest, stuff like that. Mm -hmm. Yep. Oh, oh! Waits and misses it. Yeah. Not the greatest edge guard I've ever seen. Nice. Oh, yeah, that was good. Very just, tricky. Yep. Just like that. Tommy's still in it. Yeah, you get, you get that 9%, you get one more hit. Oh! Oh, good up air. Yeah. yeah. Really like that. Yep. Oh, down tilt. Okay, side B's the ledge. No problem there. Oh, Back okay. Here, almost gonna do it. 142 here. I think about just about anything should kill here. They okay, aren't playing the dash dance game. Okay. Oh, tries to get the down. Yeah. Oh, man. <laughs> just needs one tipper fair. Yep. Oh. Three hit. Or one tip or anything almost, probably. Yeah. There it is. There it nice. is. Alright. All right. Oh, we're taking a swig. Yep. Mid sip or mid game <laughs> sip is like so risky. <laughs> yeah. Oh, oh, oh yeah. I think another back here actually hits there. Oh. Yeah, I think you're right. But try to switch it up with the fair. Yep. Yeah. Oh, kind of trying to force the issue with the S smash, yeah. Oh, good up E. Yep. Oh, yeah, these fares. Really it's damage. Good. Yeah, sniping Jigglypuff out of the air. Wow. Ooh, no tipper, but... Yeah, risky grab, too, I feel like. Yeah, a little bit. Oh. Yeah, oh. that's the H <laughs> That's the Marth Killer 2.0 right there. Yeah. Oh, what an amigo! Wow. Super sweet spot. Yeah, that's actually so hard to do. Yeah. Yep. All right. Jumps into the tipper, and that's yep. going to be... Slingshot, and now we're probably going to get two games of Dreamland. <laughs> Dreamland? Yeah. Probably. Most definitely. So... Yeah, that is the PPU. If Arn wants to win this, this... It's going to be a long one. True. <laughs> yep. This is scary. Oh. oh! Oh, teched in. Gotta be careful. Yep. Re grab the ledge. Definitely not what Tommy wanted. Right. Sheesh. Oh, man. That was actually crazy. Yeah, right. Covering a lot there. And Tommy Good. nodding his head to the Dreamland music. <laughs> Aren't still fighting, but. Yep. Cool. Ooh. All right, and I just edge cancel, but it's just. It's gonna take so much to kill Tommy. Yeah. Like, you have to have these pivot tippers, I think. Yeah. Because then off most of these throws, it's a kill for Arn, but instead, Tommy just gets more chances to live. Oh, man. Tries to hit him with the Wii Wah. <laughs> Just barely out of range. Classic. Yeah, I know. Oh man, that's exactly. Oh. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> Damn. I can't quite hear what he's saying, but yeah, yeah it's like. I don't know. He's saying it's the game right now. It's the game's problem. <laughs> hey. Well. Check the disc. Yep. Oh. Oh. Dare just barely missing. Yeah, but aren't. Can't quite. Oh, we're rolling and spot dodging around. <laughs> I feel like a Marth up is incoming right here, but maybe not. <laughs> that's too risky. It is very risky. Oh, double oh, DDD. Double uh, DDD into. <laughs> into Marth missing the sweet spot. Yeah. yeah. Okay, All side right. B up tilt. One Marth killer. Yeah, such. An uphill battle here for Arn. For rolling the spot judge. True. <laughs> when I do it, people think my controller's broken. But when Tommy does it, they say it's genius. 
Yeah. Maybe it is. Maybe I had to do that more. Maybe. I gotta roll around and spot dodge more. Rolling's, I gotta say, like, even though Game Watch has a terrible roll, like, <laughs> you gotta use it every once in a while. Oh, that's true. Your roll is awful. <laughs> it's so bad. It's just it cartwheeling. so long. Yeah. Oh, Ooh, there's a hold on. massive tipper. Arn brings it back. He's clawing his way back into this game here. Yep. Oh, okay. Ooh, Ooh there's some there. damage. Yeah, yeah, I really like that. Falling up here. That's a good amount of damage. Yep. Yeah. Oh, good to tech okay. in place, but rolls in after. Oh, yeah, good wait for the roll. Yep. Man. Oh. Oh, down here, no? That's all right. Damage is damage. Yep. Arn with the percent lead here. Yeah, brought this all the way back. That tipper was massive. Oh, yeah. <sighs> yeah. Ooh. Yeah, Arn is rolling after Wait. these dares too much. Right. Oh, oh get up, though. Just the get up attack. Or ledge attack, yeah. Oh, what yeah, a Yeah, you can't air dodge there. <laughs> what a time to miss it. Oh, oh hold up. fantastic ah. upbeat, but yeah, gonna get bared. Good tech. All right, this is tournament stock for this Arn. Is... All right. Oh, oh, dude, that was so close to just being over. Oh, we're walking to oh. <gasps> Dude, Dude, down air. The down air, probably. That yeah, one of the down foot. B. Yeah, yeah. That's, that <laughs> is for sure a missing foot. But we're rolling around. We're spot dodging. Yep. Oh, oh, man. Falls out of the nair. He's a little afraid, I think, to F smash because he knows that if he misses, he's going to get rested. Yeah. I mean, you know Tommy's looking to just end it now. Right. You're at this high percent. Might as well go for a rest. And if you hit it, you win. If you don't, you play on, but... Yep. Oh, Almost. not quite gonna do it. Yeah. Oh. oh. Dang. Yep. Ooh. Oh, there's that falling back here again. I think this is it. Oh. oh. So scary. 174 and Orange just can't quite get it. Oh wow. Dude. <laughs> I mean, and Tommy's playing it keep away real well on the other side of things. Like, Arn cannot get a hit. Ooh, side B up air. Yep. Still not over. <laughs> I, heard, I, I heard Hawk Tua. Uh-oh. <laughs> oh! Oh, had to jump. Yeah. That is going to do Damn. a little pop-off from Tommy. Arn. Not yeah, I mean, lose your semis. Yeah, good stuff to Tommy. I know Tommy really wanted that. Yeah, and uh, he wants to prove the haters wrong. True, there were a lot of haters. <laughs> there were a lot of haters, but I was not one of them. You know, he was also talking to Smack. So that is little, true. Little maybe you play. know, maybe that's what Hog needs. As long as it doesn't, you know, cross yeah, a certain yeah, line. Yeah, yeah. A little Absolutely. competitive spirit, you know. Absolutely. Super happy to have him. Uh, yeah. Stuff to Tommy. Yeah. We're going to see Artie Tommy now. Losers Ooh, Finals. This is Losers Finals. Artie Tommy. And Artie is pretty good at the Puff matchup, I will say. True. True. So this will be interesting to see. Yep. <laughs> and for those of you that don't know, um, Tommy is from Long Island. Oh, okay. Goes to uh school in Yukon. Huh. And uh, as a freshman, yeah, he's been showing up to the UConn tournaments. The origin story is actually pretty funny. Um, Kuro, you know. Yep. Oh, is it? UConn. Um, <laughs> Was this his Reddit <laughs> post? Yeah. Ah. So fellow UConn uh, smasher, Kuro, um, put up a post on Reddit saying, at first it was like $10. If you can beat me at this game, I will give you $10. <laughs> and I think he did it for like two or three sets and no one could beat him. All right, we're going right into it. Wow. Um, so I'll have to wrap the story up quickly. But then, yeah, this guy, Tommy, comes up and is like, all right, it's been a while since I played. And and so he takes... And at this point, Kuro is like, all right, it's 20 bucks now. And so Tommy's like taking him to game five and Kuro's like sweating. But it was, it was apparently like Tommy's first time playing um, in a long time. But yeah, gotcha. Kuro ended up clutching on Tommy. And then next week, Tommy shows up and then just washes everybody. <laughs> yeah. You know? So... 
Damn. then he beats Beckspin this past Monday, but Beckspin added a run back and uh, yeah, yep. beat him game five. Anyway, yeah, um, curious, curious what he was doing uh, before UConn, like how he got so good. You know? Yeah, I mean, he's been to a couple of the collisions, the past yeah. two collisions, and I think it was Shine 2022. Okay. Or, yeah, so lost to 99 wood, wood cutting and someone else, but... That's a crazy tag. Yeah. <laughs> yep. I, love, I love that tag. Yeah. I think they're a chic player from, I don't know, actually nowhere, but somewhere in New England. Anyway. Nice. Um, pretty even so far. Yeah, this... Hmm. I have many theories about this matchup. Yep. Because I've played it a fair bit. One of my Toronto friends, big peach player. Hmm. And I used to play a lot of Puff. Oh yeah. Um, oh, misses the grab there. Gets punished for that. Yeah. So Puffs are afraid to be compared to H-Box because H-Box is perceived as being lame. <laughs> yes. This is the truth. This is the truth. I've heard no. it from J-Killer. Yes. No Puff. If someone says, wow, you, you play just like H-Box, that is an insult to Puff yeah. players. Um, but I think H-Box... It's like impressive is, what oh. HBox has been able to do with the character, and you know, love it or hate it, I think you got to give him credit. Wow. Yeah, it's also the style of play. I think you have. Oh, oh yeah. That was Sorry. Yeah, I like that's that. No, 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 it's fine. Yeah. Um, yeah, I think you have to play this matchup super lame as buff. I think you need yeah. to get a you need to get a back air. You need to get the percent lead, lead, and then you have to run away the whole game. Right. Which no one wants to do that. No one does. Yeah. Because Peach is really good at scrapping in close quarters, and lo like Peach's aerials. Again, if you're close, right. like that Nair, it just comes out so oh, fast geez. and has so much priority. Peach's Nair is insane. Yeah. You got to respect it. So. Yeah, I get it. Like, the optimal play for Puff is to not go in, ever. Yeah. Which is super lame. Oh, yeah. Yeah. I feel bad when I play Falcons because it's the same thing, I feel like, <laughs> where he's good at just, like, scrapping. And if you get hit by one knee, you're just dead. Yep. And, yeah, it's just it's rough. Like, he can just grab you, down throw, up air, up air. And so I feel like I just have to play lame, crouch, back throw him, and then yep. just gimp him. <laughs> yep. So anyway, yeah, uh, that's just how some matchups are in this game. Yeah, it's, hate it. it's similar to I think, in my opinion, Puff Ices as well has a similar game game plan where oh is Zoso? I guess yeah. Is that Zoso? Mm. Oh wow. Sheesh. Yep. Nice. Down air up smash. Yeah, that one wasn't real, but that's all right. <laughs> uh, yeah. <laughs> Bounced already off the ground. Yeah. But, uh, already was smiling. Yep. Didn't matter. Ooh. There was also a rest opportunity on the the last stock, but Tommy did not quite go for the go for it. Mm -hmm. That's the other thing. I think you should always be going for rest setups. I mean, obviously you always go for rest as puff, but in this one matchup specifically, Peach's punish off sleeping puff is not that great. Yeah, it doesn't seem that good. Yeah, it's just biased so much in your favor. Like if you do the math. You're like, you should eat four rest punishes uh, a stock, like right. four missed rest punishes. Because if you, if you hit one of those four, uh, this is like game theory. <laughs> um, <laughs> yeah, someone could do the math on that, but like, if Ooh. you have a thirty percent chance to hit the rest, you should probably go for it. Right. That kind of thing. Playing the. I think odds. that makes sense. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, oh didn't quite barely get there. missing. Yeah. Artie's still floating in that parasol. Slow get up. Oh, they're getting so close on these edge guards. Oh, Lexi Thompson. Dang. Off smash. All right. He's going to do it. Oh, Tommy Bobbin. Artie yep. trying to lock in. Oh, up air, not quite going to do it. Almost, but yeah, not going to do it. Oh yeah, invincibility from the ledge really helping out Tommy there. You're done. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, up tilt. <sighs> Gotta be careful. That's the big one in this matchup. In most matchups, but this one in particular. Yeah. And you also have to be careful because up tilt hits in front of Puff as well. Might see that happen. True. True. Uh, Pokemon Stadium, okay. Small one. <laughs> rooting as you got. <gasps> oh yeah. my gosh, dude. So Off quick the with the rest. Ooh, already missing the double fair too. Yeah, so it's like what Tommy's doing now is actually, <laughs> in my opinion, suboptimal because he's going in after having a lead. Oh, but, yeah. But, you know, if he makes it work. 
true. He, if he makes it work, he will be perceived as not a lame buff. So. Yeah. <laughs> Fair enough. Don't be sorry. Don't be sorry, Kuro. <laughs> <laughs> Hardy. Hardy's oh. the homie. Oh. Let's go both players, though. <laughs> That's true. Let's go both players. Ah, Hardy. But yeah. I, I actually want to see Artie win this game because I do want to see more melee. So <laughs> let's <true>. go Artie. <laughs> yeah, and at the end of the day, as much as I talk about Puff versus Peach, on the other side, this is a bad matchup for Peach. <laughs> yeah, no, it's true. How bad think, do you think it is? I don't think it's as unwinnable as back in the H-Box Armada days. Sure. You know, people were like, oh, Armada had to, was trying Young Link and had to switch to Fox. Oh, yeah, that was, um, yeah. I don't think it's quite that unwinnable for Peach, but it's still definitely bad. I'm thinking like 60-40. Yeah, 60-40 territory, maybe 65-35. 65-35, yeah. But Laud has beaten HBox, so. Oh yeah. You know, there Truly is doable. room. There's definitely room to grow in this matchup. Yeah, no, for sure. Joshua's retired? You never know. Sometimes people like playing the game. Even after quote unquote retirement. True, true. Hardland's getting Oh, married. wow. On it. <laughs> Damn. That's cool, though. Tell me you're not going. You're not going to skip a wedding to go to a, a melee tournament? Come on. <laughs> All right, you're the, oh, you're the best man. True. <laughs> that I didn't even get to that part. Yeah. Yeah. Skipping the best man. Go play melee. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not gonna. Yeah. Down air, up air. Yeah. That's a classic from Beach, but. True. Already bringing it back. A little bit. Oh, wow. that's a big hit. Massive percent. Ooh, they're scrapping. Which always makes me afraid for Puff. Like, that's big damage for Artie. Okay, back air is gonna do it. That's crazy, Nereal. But yeah, <laughs> back air. And I know Tommy's looking for a rest here. Yeah, oh that yeah. That is all I would be looking for. When Peach is at this lower percent. Yep. Ooh, oh, good SDI good, from Artie. Yeah, yeah. good DI, yeah. Yeah, it's, I mean, I really hope Wavelength's going to be a mainstay. I feel like it will be, you know? Yeah. Hotel tournaments, Yeah. love them. You know, they're yeah. great, and I, I think they're here to stay, so super hype. <laughs> Balatron Mobile, true, that did come <laughs> out. All right, hey, yeah, rough Tommy spot. Yeah, rough spot for Artie. Yeah. Tommy, playing it patient, playing it well. And. Yep. Little it's trade tough. is gonna do it, yeah. This is a rough one. Hardy taking a sip of the water here. I think yep. it's all done. All gone. Swigged it down. Yep. My wedding at my turn. True. Yeah, I don't know if I'll have melee at my wedding if I ever have one. That's uh Oh well, maybe. They'll they'll probably they'll be friendly setups. I don't know about a tournament. Yeah. Tournaments are yeah. That's that's a little weird much. environment. Yeah. yeah. At the reception so friendly's at the reception, that's about it. Yeah. Fair enough. All right, we're playing mini melee on Yoshi's. That's all right. <laughs> Yo, Kelly. Yo, Kelly. Bracket all at the right. rehearsal reading. I'm down for that. That's a vibe. And with the vibe check. That's second of the Yukon Ultimate Arcadian. Wow. Uh, who? Tommy? Tommy, yeah. yeah. Tommy also plays, yeah. Ultimate. Plays a, dabbles in ultimate. Well, yeah. I mean, clearly. <laughs> yeah, well. I don't doubt Tommy is a legitimately good player. <laughs> Grammar is required to en enter. Yeah. If you have grandma's smiley face. <laughs> Back here gonna do it. What stage did we just play on, by the way? Oh, before this? Yeah. Uh, Pokemon. Pokemon. Oh, oh, already went a little low. Already smiling though, so you know he's in good spirits here. Oh, oh, tries to get the rest. Tommy is not happy. <laughs> <laughs> I think. That, oh, 
Oh my gosh, yeah. I, I mean, respect. Again, this is what I'm saying. You should be going for those. Yeah, it's, he's only taking like 15%. Each yeah, exactly. Time. It's really not that bad. But, like, yeah, I don't know. It, it just it seems like it's worse than it actually is when you miss a rest, but it really isn't that big yeah. a deal. Versus rest speech. is a small hitbox, you know? It is tiny. Ooh. Okay. Already trying to be tricky here with the way he's falling. Mm. Coming down with fair, bear. <laughs> yep. Oh, downer, bear. Yep, that's going to do it. That's gonna get it. All, All right. right. Up there. Yeah, up there kills really early. We're Whoa. going crazy with the nares. All right. Oh, <laughs> yep. downer chain. Yep. Tommy waiting. Oh, oh F smash. Dash or yeah, F smash. or, or yeah. yeah, either either would be good. But yep. Ooh, Ooh, huge down percent. smash. Yeah. Yep. Yeah, Loki. I like this Yoshi's pick. Like, already just wants to be closer and scrapping all the time. Yep. And it's working out real well. All right, not quite gonna oh, do man. it. It's close. Parasol ledge dash. I doubt it. <laughs> I didn't know what you're talking about, but I don't think. You know, already could get um, you can get notches for that. I think they may have been banned though. I can't remember. Uh, by the controller it. committee. Fair Is enough. Because I think Peach with a invincible ledge dash, that's a little too much power. Yeah, too scary. I mean, invincible ledge dash down smash, that's messed oh, up. Oh, yeah. And Tommy pop it off. He's like smiling too. Oh, already. I'm already missing the. <laughs> Still got there. it at the end, but. Oh, Stitch! Uh -oh. Hold up. Hold up. Hold on. Oh, wait a minute. Ah, uh, dude, these oh. oh man, these up tilts are so scary. Yeah, all right, already with the lead though. I think down tilt. Oh, 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 he's holding in. It. Oh, yeah. didn't quite die. Oh, what a trade! Wow, already getting another chance here. Yep. Goes for the down smash. Oh, the yep. Down air flipped, already, but it didn't matter. Oh, this is Artie's best shot. Oh, that back yeah. air. <gasps> oh. oh. Duh, we're stuck. <laughs> <laughs> oh, right, wow. Yeah. Already struggling to find a way in. Oh, oh jeez. Dude. <laughs> yeah, not quite at Nair percent. I, I think it's going to kill now, Nair. Yeah. Uh, it's, yeah, it's close. Go for up air. Up air up to air, shield. Air. There it is. There it is. Already All nodding right. his head. Already on the he's board. He's ready to go on to game four. Yeah. <laughs> Keeping it alive. Ooh. And he's getting another water. This is the bingy strat. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Oh, ice, I, ice him out. <laughs> oh, I don't even ice up people. Oh. <laughs> I don't know. People, people get up versus what I'm playing or what that's I'm true. sitting down. Yeah, that's true. If anything, they're taking more time than me. I just want to sip my water in between each game. I'm allowed a couple seconds. Mm. I'm allowed 30 seconds, am I not? True. I don't know. That's true. It's like on ranked, right? You get how many seconds between your next game if you wait out the time. It's like you get, what, a minute and like 15 seconds? Between what, sir? Like, if you're playing ranked, oh, I'm yeah. saying that, like, you know, you have 30 seconds to pick, or for them to ban a counter pick. It's like, if, if let's say, hypothetically, like, your opponent knew what they were going to counter pick, pressed it, and then, like, made, allowed you to pick your counter pick, you would yeah. have 30 seconds to pick a stage, and yep. then they knew their character, they would press A, and then you have 45 seconds to pick a character. Uh, gotcha. Anyway. That's true. Um, yeah. So Dreamland. Yeah, no surprises. Tommy wants to live as long as possible. True. That is true. Ooh. But so far, yeah, Artie doing a good job. He's adapting. That's what Artie does. I think um, this could prove to be troublesome for Tommy if uh, Artie, you know, plays it right. Already pull a turnip, true. Yeah, I hope he pulls more turnips. I feel like Artie doesn't like to fish for stitches. I feel like he'll yeah. just kinda like pulls turnip and if it's a turn like if it's a yeah, he'll just he'll just take whatever turnip he can get. Yep. Ooh. Yeah, I mean Loki, this stage is gonna be a double edged sword for Tommy. Oh never mind, oh. that DI was not great. Never mind. Yeah, that was <laughs> good find by Tommy. Yeah, I was gonna say because uh, 
Tommy's been doing a good job of getting right. a lot off of rest. And yep. if, again, if you miss your opportunity to rest versus Artie. Oh, oh no, dude. dude. Ah. That's unfortunate. Yeah, Puff F Smash is crazy strong. It is stronger than uh, Marth Tipper, F Smash Tipper. Puff's F Smash? Yeah. Wow, did not I know that. I'm pretty sure. Yeah, oh, no tech. Good. Yeah. All right, brutal. Brutal for Artie. Yeah. See, now you're at the percent where you're not going to get up tilt rested, but... I was going to say it's a double-edged sword, but... Those rests from Tommy. Yeah. Alright. Good little dash attack. Yeah. This is looking rough for our boy. Reverse fair. This is just rinse and repeat, but... <laughs> <laughs> Tommy, trying to get up there. That's not Almost. quite going to do it. Back air, stale as He's hell now. Yep. Alright, up air is going to do it. So Tommy... Good stuff. Gotta get the run back versus Beckvin. Artie? Beating Artie. No slouch. Yeah, at a respectable third, I think. This is a big tournament, and that is not a favorable matchup for Artie. Yep. Tried to make it work, but... Tommy, though. Tommy's legit. Tommy's real, he beat yeah. Artie. He beat the house. <laughs> yep, beat Beckvin. Beat Beckvin, too. At the other but tournament. Can he beat Beckvin on our CRT? That's the question. Oh, true. Because they played on monitors, and Beckvin is not a big fan of monitors. Yep. And not Beckvin, to John for, for yeah, Beckvin. Yeah, yeah. But, I mean, I don't know. It's a different it's a different beast we're playing against here. Um, oh. oh. Be Beckvin with the mental game. So, wait. What I didn't see the winner set. How did like what character did Beckman uh, play? Beckman played Marth game one and game two and lost both of them. No way. Pretty and he convincingly. First three Odom with Ices. That's insane. Yeah. Yeah, Tommy. Here, here's the scoop. Uh, Tommy does some very unsafe aerials against ice climbers. Like he uh. full drifts in and hits one climber, but that's not good enough. You got to be pulling back these aerials. Right. Like you're playing hit and run. As Puff, yeah. Whereas I don't know, he he lands near the climbers, which is just not what you want to be doing. Right. Oh my God. Oh man. Shh, clinical. The timings, the handoffs, dude. Yeah, that's Beckman's the other thing. Not missing these. Yeah, and Beckman's not going for any crazy handoff stuff. Mm -hmm. It's like grab, pseudo wobble, up smash. Right. Nothing fancy. Whatever gets the whatever gets the job done. Oh, yep. extra damage, yeah. Yeah. Dude. Wow, down air, down smash. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Yeah, see, now Beckman knows Tommy's a little frustrated and yep. willing to just trade out all these smash attacks. That's so much damage. Tommy's got to slow this down. Ooh, see, like there. That there was so spooky. Mm. Like landing right there. I think yeah. you got to be doing more rising berries if you're, if you're Tommy. Yeah, like that. Right, right. And then on the flip side, I think overall macro game plan, you gotta play lame as Puff. You have to yeah. get the lead at the start of the match and run away. Right. Which sucks, because no one wants to be that guy, but no one wants to be H-Box. That's what it is. It's true, it's true, but every, <laughs> yeah. Every Puff main is in a internal you know, turmoil with themselves. You know, Inside of you, there are two wolves. One yeah. of them is cool tech Puff, and then the other <laughs> one is H-Box, and H-Box right. is right, unfortunately. Well. That's how you look at it. Yeah, I mean... Look, you gotta get a dub. If you're about competition, do whatever it takes to get that dub. Low-key, I think a lot of like a lot of the reason why people kind of dislike the H-Box playstyle is because of like how H-Box was during the time he was dominant. That is and true. I, I think he's gotten better, but uh, I think, yeah, a lot of people just hate the player, and I don't know. It, it's unfortunate that they've like yeah. taken that and associated with the character of yeah. the game. They've extrapolated that if you play that way, your personality is like HBox. Right. Well, and right. that's definitely not how <laughs> so it works. So ridiculous. But <laughs> to even, yeah. All right. Good stuff to back then. Yep. Little handoff. Little up smash. Third one of the game, and 
Batman takes a quick... I mean, two minutes and 30 seconds for a Puff Icy's match. That is quick. Yeah, that is really quick. And Yoshi's too. Okay, going to yeah. FOD here. Small stage. Yep. Um, I don't know. I, I feel like Tommy needs more space. Ooh. Oh, okay. Never mind. Oh, and Nana wakes him up. All right. <laughs> That's awesome. All right, but a very risky rest from Tommy. Yep. So having to put it all on the line to get a lead. Yeah, that's the other thing. Wave dash in, up mm. smash. I played this matchup a bit. It's real good for ice climbers. Yeah. Especially if Puff is playing very, you know, aerial based. Right. Yeah, I mean, yeah. I, I know the feeling all too well, being the same exact weight as Jigglypuff. Like, oh, it's true. Like, literally, like, any smash attack will just kill super early, like, there. Yeah. So, yeah. Oh, hold on. Oh, yeah. Oh, Nana oh. getting in the way. Yeah. So, Beckman gets another, another try here. Oh, Nana. Oh, Nana dodging. rolling away. Holy smokes. All right. Yeah. Good little F smash. Nana with the taunt. Yeah. Oh, see, grabbing is just... It's risky. You, yeah, you gotta, like, F throw immediately, I think. Yeah, I think so, too. That's your that's your quickest one, and F, uh, F throw or up throw. Oh, it's gonna be handoff? Yep. No, see, it or, doesn't okay. need no, it. No, it doesn't even need it. Look at that. Knows, knows the percent, and just like that, two stocks apiece. Yep. Oh, see, like, that nair is spooky. Mm. Yeah. And, like, landing there with a back air. I don't know. I, I just notice all these little things. And no, for sure. For sure. Uh, it scares me. <laughs> yeah. No, definitely. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I think that's going to be it. Yep. 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 Yeah, I expect to get so many punishes and opportunities for those handoffs because these the aerial placement, I don't know, from Tommy just... He's committing too hard and drifting in too much. Right. Yeah. Seems really hard for Puff to deal with Blizzard as well. Uh, yeah. Yeah, you kind of just have to wait. Yeah. It's one of those things where you punish whatever happens after the Blizzard. Right. That's it. That's, yeah. Yeah, Tommy letting go of the controller 2-0. I mean, that game was looking better for Tommy, but again. Yeah. Just committing too hard and not willing to play lane 230 again on the board. Yeah. These are, these are quick matches for Icy's Puff. Very quick. Going back to Fountain. All right. I, I don't know why Fountain is the pick, but I that's guess... That's a good... Yeah, that's a good... Good trade for Tommy. Um, maybe it's because Icy's don't really like Fountain as a stage, but it doesn't seem that bad. Yeah, I don't... Oh, okay. Sent one out. Yeah. It's going to be a punish here, but... I feel like Dreamland would probably be better, but... I don't know. Um, yeah. Yeah, I don't know. Kind of... I guess it's preference, right, at the end of the day. Right, handoff? No? Ooh. This is the handoff, but Tommy, I could see in the player cam, audibly frustrated. Yeah. After getting grabbed. Right. I mean, no one likes getting grabbed, especially against ice climbers, but... Yeah. Blizzard again. Good SDI off the Blizzard, but... All right. Wow. Good up tilt. Good, yeah, yep. good rest. Yep. Ooh, Ooh. yeah. Beckman trying to wait for Nana to come down to do the handoffs, but. Yep. Not quite gonna do it with up smash there. Yeah, it's close. Ooh. Ooh, Tommy throwing everything. Yep. All right. Yeah, see that there? Not safe. Got stuck in the hit stun. Yep. From only hitting one climber. Yep. Oh, big back airs. Oh, platform. The platform. Just We're <laughs> going crazy. <laughs> the triple F smash. Yeah, very obvious what Tommy wants now. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, these nares, I don't know. Yeah. I'm not really getting anywhere. Oh, what a crazy grab. Wow. How often has been resting? Uh, this 
game in particular has been resting a lot more, which is why he's doing better, I think, but it's still brutal. Yeah. And also, what a great, like, sweet spot by Beckman. Yeah, I love that. Where, he, yep. it, like, Sopo just grabs the ledge, but Nana's still up there, and she actually is, like, I think, invincible. Yes. It has a hitbox until, like, frame, like, 28 or, like, 30 yeah. or something. Yeah, ridiculous. it is a long amount of hitbox and invincibility. Yeah. Oh, like, had to go for it all. Oh! Tried to get Blizzard, got an ice block instead. <sighs> Trying again. Oh, this damage. I think one more handoff is going to do it. Yeah, one grab. And all Tommy needs here is an up tilt. Ooh. Ooh. Trying to get Wait in. Wait a minute. Oh, dash. Oh. Oh. Yeah, that jump was so wow. bad. There yeah. it is. Crazy. They've been holding in on all those fares. And Tommy Good stuff. gets one. Gets one to go. Yep. 230 again, man. These, these yeah. are quick games. Yep. Will Tommy be able to do what Beckfin did to him in winners? Yeah, true. Let's see. All right, we're going Pokemon. Beckman swinging the hammers right off the bat. Oh. Yep. Oh. Oh, and Nana saved. Yeah. Or, with the jab, I, I think. Yeah, I don't know which one's Nana and which one's Popo, but. I think it's the white one that's Nana. Okay. But maybe. Or I get I get what you mean, yeah. Like, yeah. <laughs> like they, they, change, they, they right? switch around. Yeah. <laughs> Just <Ooh>. swinging. <laughs> Looking like Peach out there. All right. Yeah, like the fact that Beckman got a sh just a raw shield grab there. Uh, Tommy's back airs just landing in front of Puff. Or yeah. in front of Icy's, rather. Oh, oh back there, okay. Yeah, Beckman trying to react to whatever Nana's whims were. Oh, that's uh, yeah. hey, oh, the Sopo F smash. Still not out of it though. Tommy could definitely get an up tilt here and bring it back. Yeah, but gotta make something happen. Yeah. Yeah. Oh wait, I just realized that Beckfin counterpicked to Pokemon instead of FD. Yeah. Interesting. Yeah, it is curious. I mean, dying off the top a little quicker, I suppose. Oh my. Goodness. Yeah, I guess so. Maybe he wants the platforms. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I think Icy's like FD versus Spacey's in particular because you have such a good flow chart off the grab. Like up throw, dash attack, re grab. Like you get a lot on Spacey's, whereas there's not as much of a flow chart against Puff. Right. A little taunt. <laughs> Tommy having a good time. Yeah. Well, probably not, but. <laughs> <sighs> well. I don't Match know. Up. It seems like he's had a fun night at the very least. Yeah. I mean, again, don't want to count him out, but. Still, coming here, getting yeah. second. That is... <laughs> okay. <laughs> Beckfin trying to style here. Yeah. I'm sure Beckfin um, is pretty pleased right now, but again, like, yeah. Oh, my God. Yeah. <laughs> good stuff to Beckfin. Up smash. Nice yeah. handshake. Yeah, good handshake. And I think so, I heard yeah. thanks for the games as well. So Yeah, good, good stuff. stuff. Very, um, Beckfin's revenge, if you will. This, is, this tournament has been... Yeah. Uh, redemption arc for Beckman versus Tommy, but still Tommy getting second, kind of plowing, plowing through everyone else. To be honest, really did. Yeah, um, three owed Brub, three like three one Arn, and then three one almost, almost three owed Arty, but three like Arty yeah, Arty and... clutched it. Yeah, that last third game. Yeah, and then three one Arty. Or, yeah, so so good stuff. To, good stuff. Uh, good to Tommy. see Tommy. Absolutely. Good to see new blood really and impressive. Yeah. I wonder if we'll, they'll have Amis or not. I don't actually know. We'll see. Yeah, this was a crazy tournament. This was a big tournament. Big tournament. 28 entrants. Yep, 28. Almost 30. Yep. People from New York. J Killer. We got J of Killer. Course. Yep. J Killer. Dong Dysfunction came through. Yep. Kezup also came through. Yeah, Kezup. It was a good to see Kezup. Yep. Beckman. Beck. Always a pleasure seeing Beckman. Oh, yeah. Farm in our tournament. Mm -hmm. All right, I yep. think, I think uh, it's going to be probably be it. Probably. I don't know if we're going to do a post-tournament interview or not, but yeah. it looks like, yeah, everybody's kind of... Kind of mellowed out. <laughs> yeah. A little yeah. bit. All right, huh? we're going to do Redemption. Uh, Bracket. Don't go anywhere. Yeah.
there will be some Emmys coming through. True, 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 true. The to the fans want to see a Tommy interview? All right. I think I'm going to go get Tommy then. I'll catch you guys later. Oh, it's been a pleasure. All right. Yep. BRB. Yeah. And I think of, uh, think of stuff to say. Uh, sure. If you want. <laughs> I think they're trying to get Tommy, but oh, sorry, okay. calm down. I mean, if he wants to go on. <laughs> the chat, and by the chat, I mean Abel. Uh, shout out Tommy. <laughs> good win. Good. Uh, yeah. Icy's puff. Huh? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Looking good, honestly. Looking yeah. real good. I felt alright about it. I messed up. I was annoyed that game three. I messed up. He missed the rest and he blizzard banana. You can just get your novel free. True. And I ice blocked. Ice him, blocked. And yeah. then he flew up, and then he fared me. <laughs> he died. Yeah. Time's good. Um, hope to see him out some more. We'll see. Yep. I don't. I don't know when I'll be able to play him again because I, I can't really come out for a while. True. Uh, but Arcadian? Not Arcadian. Wrong word. Wrong word. Amateur racket? Yeah. This is Amy's. If you want to comment, <laughs> I'm we're down. doing we're doing an interview, but that's all right. No. no, no. So we got Scroll Venom. Scroll oh, this Venom. is Grands. Nice. This is Grands. We do have Yukon and Hog. Yep. Scroll pretty good. I feel bad for Scroll. He so he had to play me at Yukon, and then oh. here, well, first round at Yukon, he had to play me, and then here is first round, he had to play Kaz Keza. Oh. So he just got That's, the the chic ICs. Yeah, full ICs mode. Yeah. yeah, I played Scroll today. He was playing pretty good. Mm -hmm. Went game five, but. Yeah, we gotta make sure we get Tommy on here after, after yeah. this. Yeah, I'm down. Yeah. Oh, you can interview Tommy if you want. I mean, that's kind of BM, but. <laughs> uh, I mean, up to I mean, if you didn't feel like it, but I'm not. Sure. I'm down. But I'm down was, either way. He was super nice. He said that whenever he leaves the people, that he shakes their hand, which, like. <laughs> uh, on UConn on Monday, we were definitely worried about him having ego, but, like, you know, if you're willing to lose and shake someone's hand, then, like, you know, he's not, like, happy when he's winning and, like, a dick when he's sad, you yep. know, when he loses, which is what you like to see. Yeah, yeah. definitely a good mentality. Yeah. Sheesh. And Skrull. Do you know, I mean, I guess they probably haven't played before. Skrull's not really coming out here. Um, no, a Skrull comes out here pretty often, uh, and so, so does yeah. Venom. So, yeah, these are kind of two mainstays of Hog. Mm -hmm. I, I feel like I see them in grands of Amis pretty frequently. So, I'm sure... Scroll's pretty solid. I, I feel like, I don't know how long he's been playing, um, but he has really good ideas a lot of the time, and it's just like, feels like he hasn't been in there long enough for some yeah. of stuff. Yeah. Like that, look at that! <laughs> uh, that yeah. yeah, but you know, like doesn't clean it up at the end. Yeah, I gotta say, he's definitely an up-and-comer. Mm -hmm. I feel like we've been saying that for a while, but... Yeah. Definitely a grinder, definitely someone who VOD reviews and tries to get better at the game. Super nice too, which is yeah. always something you look for and if, like it's so much easier to like a person and you know like want to see them do well and it's like oh yeah that's a homie yeah they're a nice guy yeah for sure which i mean not <laughs> not that venom isn't a homie <laughs> no yeah venom's also the homie yeah, yeah. all right two stocks apiece <laughs> legally obviously <laughs> true yeah yeah get off yeah. those monitors yeah monitor melee really is different yeah. oh what an up air like that instant reaction from scroll yeah, two stocks apiece. They are oh, nice up there. Oh, that would have been fun. Oh. Yeah. You gotta love it when you get the single hit up air as Falco, like just a little poke. Oh, yeah. Such a great combo extender. Yeah. All right, that is gonna do it, though. Yeah, Venom with a lead. Scroll. Gotta figure something out here. <laughs> so, if Venom wins, do we go back here or do you think we go pop? Uh, I, th else? I think we probably go back. It is very funny that a lot of people start versus Sheik on this stage, even though it's like commonly. Oh, yeah. that needle. Oh, and Liz, wow. Oh, that yeah, needle. That's it. Oh. Ooh. All right. Yeah, the stage definitely. Most Sheiks really love going to this stage. Yeah. So. It's a good stage. As an Icy's though, I love. I do love when I, people go Battlefield, and I get to go. Uh-uh. <laughs> no. <laughs> no. True. And then you immediately ban ban Battlefield right yeah. after. That's a classic. Yeah.
like a couple matchups that it stays in, but 99% of the time is someone asking him, like, do you know yep. what character I am? <laughs> oh, tech chase? Oh, nice Yeah, I was gonna say, scroll. Oh, a needle there goes crazy, yeah. standing needle, but Dang. didn't get there. Yeah, he's been doing good with those needles. He just hasn't, like, he's he's hitting them, he's just not finishing, you know? Yeah. Yeah, definitely gotta work on the post yeah. needle hit play. Ooh, gets another oh, chance. Oh. Up smash. <laughs> Whoa, looking like Fox. Yeah. Right. Funny move. Up smash on Falco is always funny when it kills. I yeah. Think. Is Loki good on like Yoshi's though under the platform because yeah. it hits yeah. uh, hits above on the Pick platform below? Like oh yeah. Why is it there? Why they do that? Why is it so strong? <laughs> the old scorpion kick. Yeah. They, they did some evil shit. <laughs> this is a wacky game. You yeah. can definitely tell this game was developed in like eight months. And why doesn't Kirby do that? <laughs> That's true. His up smash is like. I mean, Kirby's gutted. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Absolutely we, good. My friends and I started, I don't know if you've ever heard of Crazy Hand, but it's like a client that lets you um, just like adjust settings in the game. And one day one of our friends was like, how good would Kirby be if he had puff air drinks? So oh we went God. into Matt, their Crazy Hand and we added that. Damn. And now we got a whole ISO going called Crazy Kirby. Oh. And the second edition was, um, you know, when I think it was Rishi made that tweet that was like, if Peach had Fox run speed, which would be the best in the game. Oh, yeah. So we were like, all right, well, let's just put that in the ISO. True. <laughs> and then it kept going. Um, nice. Yeah. Like, she, we made Sheik Dare be a spike, but only the lower half of it is. Oh. There's, like, a whole bunch of stuff like that. That's wild. Um, that's super fun. Yeah, I sounds, recommend it to everyone. Sounds like blast. Yeah. We are on pod. Yeah. Yeah, it makes sense, I think. I'm kind of holding it down. Yeah, scroll. Not yeah. finding many grabs, I think, is the big thing. I mean. Yeah. And like when he does find them, he's just like not getting too much. Yep. Like he can he can get there. You know, he can get like an opening or something. But it yep. feels like when he's at that point where it's like, all right, now do more with it. He's struggling. Yeah, just a little bit. Yeah. Fine, there. Not quite enough. Yeah, I feel okay. like you, you kind of have to be cheesy in this matchup as Sheik as well. Like, mm -hmm. you want to be gimping Falco as often as possible. Yeah. You know, stay near the ledge, grab, get some back throws, and then mm -hmm. do stuff like that. I feel like Skrull's playing a little too honestly, you know? Yeah. Go the up air. Platform? Kind of messing up in it, but... Mm -hmm. oh. oh! Scary. <laughs> yep. Oh, nice nair. Ooh. Yeah, I feel like could, could have been a grab. Yeah. Or scroll, but. Yeah. Their shine's so hard to contest. Yeah. It feels like it should be so much more contestable. <laughs> it really is invincible and frame one. Yeah. Which is crazy. Ooh, nice. Can't Sweet. find those needles. Sweet spot, yeah. I mean, on the flip side, my uh, Venom's combos have been really good too. Classic pillars, but. Getting a good chunk of damage off of every opening. Mm -hmm. oh. Always. Oh, went for it. Yeah. Oh, no. Getting stuck in rapid jab. Skull having a little trouble here for sure. Yeah. And I guess you, you don't transform here? Brave? It's alright. It's actually, actually playing the better character, anyways. Ah! Another that's, up that's smash kill. <laughs> yeah, finished <laughs> off with up smash. <laughs> Laser up smash. Can we get a third? Well, now this is when um, this is when scroll rips out the up, sm uh, up smash to end the game. True. Yeah, that went a little better, but. And Venom and losers. Yeah. yeah, I'm curious if these two played already or not. Oh, oh. <laughs> I don't know if you'll is be it able just to find hog it. Challenge, right? Yeah, probably. Challenge is a, a beast to try and find things on. <laughs> yeah. If you know where things are, then like you can make it work. Yeah. But it's definitely otherwise... a lot more lightweight than Smash.gg, but. Yeah. Oh, I found the hog. Hall of Gaming. Tournaments. We're getting there. We're getting there. My entrance. Um, Venom lost round one to Akami. So this is a run. Wow. Yeah, that's a big run. There's probably a lot of people in Emmys today. Uh, nine people. All right. And then Scroll beat Alex Firewind, Cyber Bunny, and Geo. But 
Venom beat Atticus, Cyber Bunny, Cyber Bunny Game 5, and Alex Fire win Game 5. Sheesh. And then Geo 3 1. And now wow. we're here. Yeah, this crazy run for Venom. Man. Yeah, this yeah. would feel real good to win. <laughs> <laughs> if, you're, yeah. if you're Venom, lose round one and just do the gauntlet. Yeah. Especially after regular bracket. Yeah. And going two sets, grand yeah. finals, too. Holy smokes. Good beast. All right, scroll on the board, but mm -hmm. yeah, it just feels like I'm not getting the tech chases. I'm not really getting the edge guards, too. I feel like I haven't really seen a, a full edge guard from scroll. Oh. Yeah, yeah right just idea. the tech chases. It's just not, not quite hitting. Yeah, and I mean, as Sheik, you really need those tech yeah, chases. Yeah, you really do. And I, I mean, against Falco, it's hard. Because, you know, we stroll so far. Yeah. But, like, Venom just holding it down. Yeah. F-Smash is working out real well for Venom as well. Scroll gonna have to take it in a minute. Yeah, I'm gonna have to think about this next yeah. set. Assuming it goes to one. Yeah. Which, I mean, <laughs> three socks though on it's looking pretty hard. Yeah, it's a tough one. Oh. Oh! <laughs> Get it? Yeah. Yeah. All right, not out of the realm of possibility for school to come back from this, but Let's see what we can do. Oh, All right, here we go. Anything? Oh, nice. the classic. <laughs> oh, no yeah. boost grab. Yeah, true. Boost grab might have made it there. Yeah, I wonder if he's just been missing his boost grabs or something. Oh, the, <laughs> the latest phantom. Yep. Yeah. Double down here. All right. That's a reset. Quick little three zero for Venom and. Venom, she hurt, right? Yes. Okay, yeah. I thought so, and I said it earlier, but I, I wanted to double check. Yes, I believe so. We're changing tech. Ooh, we're, we're icing no. out. A little bit. Sar? Sar? Ah. You know what I've been on, I've been on lately? Hmm? You know what I've been on lately? Yeah. Caesar salad wraps. Oh. Chicken Caesar salad wraps? God. Yep. I've been there. I've Those are like, good. <laughs> I've had like 20 in the past two weeks. <laughs> yeah, I go to a deli, mm -hmm. and I you can put it on a sub, too, which is oh, crazy. That's good. Nice toasted bun. Yeah. Yeah, those are really good. Yeah. Like Caesar salad dressing. So good. That's, that stuff's crazy good. So good. Got anchovies in it. It's real Yeah, salty. that's the weird thing. Yeah. <laughs> I feel like... You find that out at some point in your life. That's like when your your frontal cortex fully develops. So yeah. you're like, oh, this has anchovies in it. But it's I'm chill with anchovies. Yeah, yeah. It just adds that umami, you know. Yeah. It's just like ranch on crack, basically. Mm. Tap in with the Gansett wraps. Gansett. Where is I'll, is that on like the main street coming into Yukon? Because yeah, I, I see there's a couple little spots in there. I don't speak Yukon, unfortunately. Yeah. I've never been there. I heard there's, there's a, not a whole lot out there in stores. <laughs> yeah. It's like enough for college. Yeah, uh, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah. It's just in my mind, mm -hmm. stores is just a Wild West town that has, like, you know, the the one street with the saloon and yeah. the bar and then Yukon, and then that's all of stores. Downtown area is, like, south of campus? Mm -hmm. Question mark? I know there's a chicken place that I passed by the last time, and it looked... It looks, Pretty good. I don't know if it was good. It's like on the corner. Mm. Oh, Ooh. I love that up air. That was mm. slick up air. Yeah. Yeah, back air wouldn't have made it. I think it's hard for Sheik to do cool combos a lot of the time, but some of her moves. Uh, I think it was Haven. Oh Hot yeah, Chicken. Haven Hot Chicken. They're good. They're a little pricey, but they're good. I have not been there yet. Um, it can be hard for Sheik to do cool combos, but yeah. some of, if you like hit her aerials right, like if you hit that like tipper up air. Or yeah. like, or like a falling late up air, you know? Oh yeah, those Pop, too. Popping them up, yeah. I also like um, instant rising air. Ooh. Oh yeah. Making the needles work. Yeah, scroll's been doing that out of shield yeah. a lot actually. Yeah. The out of shield rising air, it's really good. Really fast. Mm -hmm. There it is. Yeah, that that. <laughs> it just looks good, you know. Yeah. You pop them off stage with that, and then you know hit them with like a like a two piece, three piece. Like, Ooh, we're starting to make it work. Scroll cook. Oh, I feel like dash attack or F tilt goes kind of yeah. hard there, but it's all right. Yeah, this is what we were missing in the first set. Like, scroll would get those needles, yep. but then like not finish it. Yeah, the tech just have yeah. been have been a lot better yeah. this round too. He's also doing a lot of um, falling needle grab. Yeah, which is always a great option. Mm -hmm. And I feel like he's also 
he's realizing that he's not hitting the tech Jesus, so he's like, what if I just hit with aerials instead? Like, yep. I don't need to go for the grab. If I'm going to get a knockdown again if I hit with the aerial, so why yep. not? And I yeah, feel more confident. It's easier. Yeah, just got to get your opponent out of CC percent, too. So you just can't loving those rising airs. <laughs> yeah, really popping them out. Yeah. Which maybe at zero, not the best. There it is again. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, yeah. It's not I, At zero, it's not the best, but oh. Crazy to CC that. We just eat that oh. later. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, they're laughing. They're having a good time. Yeah. <laughs> That's a Falco classic, honestly. Just jump off, do something, then follow your doom. Um, winner of Amateur gets free entry the next week? Is that how it works? Mm. No, they get two dollars of instant oh, credit. $2. Oh, that's yep. it. Okay. Oh, okay. uh, I think at Gigahog. Oh, Gigahog. Right. If you win okay. Amy's at Gigahog, you get free entry into the next hog. That's cool. So yeah, two dollars in store credit. That gets yeah. you like a billion things here at Hog. Everything's so cheap. It, it does. Yeah, the bags of chips are fifty cents, which I don't know. I don't know how they do that. I think they get them uh, on the black market. Yeah, I think Artie is definitely not selling at them uh, for a profit. I don't think he's selling them at a loss either. I think he's just selling them. <laughs> oh, is it net even? We do it by not making money out. But it, is it net even or is it a loss? I hope it's net even. You're crazy if it's not. I'm, ass I'm assuming he's net even. <laughs> I know, Artie's the nicest man in the world. So <laughs> if he said he was doing it at a loss, I'd be like, I believe you. Oh my god. Now this token. is tech chasing. <laughs> Some, dude, the SAR tag? <laughs> kind of changed everything. Yeah. Oh. Become Russian for a bit, I suppose. Interesting. Let me get in there. Alright, what's the legend? 5% profit. Oh. Maybe you have to get them away if they were past it. Yeah, that's what I assumed. That makes sense. As long as it's not at a loss. 5%? Artie, are you out of your mind? <laughs> These greedy TOs. True. <laughs> this guy's making a more billion dollars every tournament. Mm -hmm. More billion. You want to know how to be a millionaire? TO one tournament. That's all I'm saying. Twenty percent, Artie? Are you serious? <laughs> yeah, I assume they, when you're selling a monster for two dollars, I'm assuming yeah. you're, you're not making yeah. any money. Yeah, water's like four hundred percent real. I mean, that you're buying them at four hundred percent markups. <laughs> that is also true. Yeah, man, whoever invented bottled water, I would love to strangle them with my hands. Yeah. What a joke. Compete and buy 10 waters. I bought one water. Huh? Huh? <laughs> nice. The rising air. Scroll is doing what Venom did to Scroll set one. Yeah. I think Scroll just was using the first set to download all the information and now he's putting it to good use. Yeah. Scroll also. Oh, not that TI. Scroll likes to sit oh. on the Zelda. Yeah, I was going to say, low key, Scroll just switched to a better character. Not going to mm -hmm. lie. Big fan of Zelda. I mean, right. he, he did it versus Kezup too. Mm. Especially, I was surprised because it was versus the Sopo. And usually, when it's Sopo, you want to oh. go back to Sheik. Yeah, true. But all right, this is the pocket pick for Venom. Venom does have a oh. hey, Marth, so this is not out of the blue. But usually, Mars don't like picking into Sheik. <laughs> yeah, and I mean, I guess Epi's the pick, but still scary. Yep. We're trading. Pokes. Yeah, which is good for Sheik, I think. Yeah, yeah. Get, getting yeah. out of the CC percent. Yeah. Oh, I right. love that. And nice the reverse. Old. Yeah, good reverse. Plain and simple, but very good. Down throw. Oh! oh. <laughs> All right, didn't matter. The most evil angle in the world. All right. Yeah, Marth counter pick. Not quite working out rough. so far, but. Let's see what we can do. Yeah, that's and, rough. And here's 60. Oh, never mind. <laughs> oh. Yeah, I didn't get the regrab. Oh, jeez! Oh, spot dodge. <laughs> These downers are really working yeah. out. Wow. Oh my God. Scroll cooking? Yeah, scroll really cooking. Yeah. What happened? Uh, scroll got some grabs and yeah. then got some follow-ups and. This is so different from the first. I mean, yeah, scroll just like tightened yeah, up oh, a little bit. Yeah, from the first set, I don't know. Scroll just locked in, I suppose. Mm -hmm. Evil grab. <laughs> yeah, that's good grab with evil grab. That's, that's a, a sheet sh grab. That's a sheet grab. Yeah, <laughs> for sure. Oh. Oh, I don't get those grabs. <laughs> yeah. Oh, oh no. Risky. Oh, oh, nice tech. Great tech. Yeah. Would have been dead otherwise, probably. Not mm, arthritis. Not looking so hot. I don't know oh. what you do. Back throw. 
go. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. Oh, what oh. the? Oh, what the? I can't believe I killed. Actually, that was such a weird sour spot. <laughs> the, <laughs> Not the reverse. Oh yeah. Oh. oh. Worth put a, maybe. Put, put an exclamation <laughs> point on there. Yeah. That's. That is quite the flex to just yeah. get the ferrets. <laughs> yeah, especially when your opponent, when you're at zero and your opponent's at like a yeah. hundred. Scroll cooking. Scroll looking to yeah. Oh, do it again. Yeah. Oh, later. <laughs> Sorry, right. but. Yeah. Beast mode by scroll on the reset. Yeah, scroll actually turned on the jet boosters in the last mm. set, so congratulations to him. And Congrats, scroll. You think he's getting two waters? You think he's getting a monster? <laughs> Four bags I of chips? I doubt he's getting two waters with the two dollar in store credit. But like, it would be really funny. Yeah. But I wonder if Tommy's still around. He should be, because I think Yukon's still here. Oh yeah, true. He's got him on the takes What's the? Is there anything that's like a quarter, like five cents? Because it could, it, could he be like, any, like he's at the arcade and get forty tootsie rolls? True. That'd be really funny. <laughs> well, I think yeah, I, I think know. the Yukon guys are still here, so I think Tommy has to be. Here. All right. Well, yeah, we might do an interview. I don't know. For the, See, oh, usually we only interview the winner, but he's probably playing friendlies already. Or the little stuff. It's like eleven twenty. Oh yeah, I got it. <laughs> work tomorrow. Man, yeah, work tomorrow. Yeah, I do. All right. Do you want me? I can go get Tommy. You can talk to him a little bit. Yeah, sure. Yeah, let, no. me, go, let me get that guy. Sounds good. Thanks. Tommy interview? Question mark? True. True words have never been spoken. How's it going, chat? What's up, Greg? Ship waters to my dorm. True, I heard Yukon is not great with uh, air conditioning. I had a friend tour with his son. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, the winner, you know, the winner has to. Yeah, what are you getting for us? Yeah, what are you getting for us, We'll see if we get Tommy or not. <laughs> Tommy, no Tommy. We got buns. He's coming over. Oh, okay. I am so tired. This works. It's been a long day. A real long day. Crick's the only one in chat. Press one if you're in chat right now. And actually listening. <laughs> one? Very good. I was gonna ask questions about Tommy, but I was like, oh, maybe I should just wait until Tommy gets here. Assuming he does get here. <laughs> How's chat's day been going? Got to watch some good melee today. Ooh. Long exam marathon. That sounds brutal. Yeah, one thing I'm happy about is no more exams for me. No, you're good, brother. Uh, yeah, this one. Just gotta hold it with that circle towards you on the mic. What's up? What's up? Hi, how you been? Don't worry, I'm pretty tired right now. You know, it's been a long day. Here. Yeah, I guess. Yeah, it's been a long day. <laughs> So, so I heard you guys wanted to interview me. Interview me. Yeah, a little bit. You know, uh, where are you from? You're new to town, right? What? You're new to town. Yeah, I'm from. I'm just for college, I guess. I'm from oh, okay. Long Island. Oh, okay, nice. Um, yeah. Well, 
if you will, like want to know like how I like play the game. Um, yeah. The way I play is uh, I literally play unranked for one hour, and um, well, over the summer I used to play for like a few hours, ra rage a bit, and then and then get off. But yeah. like the way I, but like the way I mostly actually play was like um, just studying like people like studying people from like top players and stuff. Gotcha. Like if I wa I always tune into the majors. Like if I see a major, I'm like okay, I'll watch it. I watch Hungry Box play nice. and stuff. Um, and um, what's it called? I know I did lose the tournament. I did. No, you did. You did. I did lose the tournament. But the people saying that I can't win, just c I can't win if it's a CRT, are wrong. I don't wow. know who I don't know who, the, who who's saying this stuff. But there's definitely a lot besides of rumors. Besides I can't beat him. I guess. There's a lot That's of rumors going around. That's for sure. Yeah, so, I heard, uh, I've heard a lot of stuff. <laughs> so when'd you start playing? Uh, like, mm, like the end of 2021. Okay. Wow. And Slippy Kids built different, I suppose. <laughs> yeah, I guess. Um, what's it called? It's like, I don't know. I've heard a lot of stuff about about me being a fraud and stuff like that. <laughs> no, I don't, uh, no, I don't know about that. Well, I think I you're know. legit, but I might be. <laughs> and also, like, I was very surprised that everyone came out today, though. Like, yeah, we people, had a good crowd. <laughs> yeah, people were telling me that, like, Beckvin. Oh, he, they were telling me like I was like at the UConn tournament. I asked somebody if Beckman goes to Hog, and they're like, he doesn't go to Hog. Yeah. I look at the bracket to register, and I see like the whole CCPR is trying to trying to play, and everyone's yeah. telling me they want to play me. Yep. And like on the Twitch stream and shit, like I see my <laughs> name first. Like, am I really the most notable person here? <laughs> no, I'm like the fifth, maybe seventh. Uh, but you're you're up there. You got second. That is quite a caution. This is a big tournament too. So, and you ran through a lot of names, which is good. Yeah, you know? I don't know. I feel like I could have won, but like low key. The last time I beat Beckvin, uh, his ice climbers was not cooking because he was approaching, and uh, this time he just kind of camped the shit out of me. Yeah, I, I was doing better the second set. You can't lie. I got shit on the. I got shit on when I got reverse three out. Yeah. But, what? But I was figuring out stuff. I need to figure out how to play the neutral. I had no idea what the fuck I'm doing because yeah. I just like cheesed him with like re with fucking cringy oh. ass rests. Yes, yeah, a little near rest action. I saw those. Yeah. Uh, those are good. Yeah, it's pretty funny. I don't know. Is there anything else you want to ask me about, like, melee oh. and stuff? Oh, you enjoy the tournament? Have a good time here? It's a little hot in here, but yeah. yeah that is I don't true. know when I'm going to be back, though, because uh, uh, okay. if someone give me a ride at UConn, uh, let me know. I'll go. Sure. I'll come again yeah. I got my, and pay my venue fee. <laughs> yeah, usually there's a squad of UConn guys that come out, but we'll yeah. see. Kuro's I'll, the one that goes most consistently. I don't know. Yeah, that's what he told me. See? He didn't have the best day today, but yeah, he had a rough I don't one. know. It was a hard bracket today, I'm not going to lie. So Yeah, it was tough. All right, well, good stuff. Congratulations on second. Yeah. Hope Hoping you come out you. tomorrow, yeah. yeah. Oh. <laughs> yeah, you're good. Yeah. I'll come back one day. Yeah. Maybe not today. Maybe the next week. Maybe not next month. But yeah. someday. We'll see you.